I should answer, where do you come from? From the east, and I am hoping that you will give my message on the square for the sake of the widow's son. Well done, gentlemen. Congratulations. As chairman of the Order of Skulls and on behalf of the council, and the 322 alumni throughout the world, gentlemen, you are welcome. Welcome home. Well, I tell you, let me give you a little inside information about God. God likes to watch. He's a prankster. Think about it. He gives man instinct. He gives you this extraordinary gift, and then what does he do? I swear, for his own amusement, his own private cosmic gag reel, he sets the rules in opposition. It's the goof of all time. I think church is, has very little to do with spirituality. I think... Uh, it's something you have to find in yourself. And we are live, and the doors of the Sanctum have been unlocked and opened again for the week. Welcome, everyone, back to the Sanctum Sanctorum. I am your illustrious host, Widow Son. And uh, one, all my, my awesome co host will not be with us today. I know Splicer is out of town with family. Wanderer may pop in here in just a little bit. I knew he said he was uh, out with his family for uh, Father's Day. Um, so we'll see. If he will join us in just a little while. Also, I've sent the links, uh, the link out to several other of the uh, the friends, folks, and the bros to come and join us. And um, yeah, today we're just gonna kick it, and we're just gonna talk about whatever we may uh, rip on some internet stuff and uh, see what we can get into. But uh, yeah, we're just gonna be uh, smoking, drinking, having a good time. Uh, also, want to go ahead and let everyone know that this Tuesday. We will be doing not a regular episode of the Sanctum because you know uh, you'll always notice that the Sanctum is always numbered and everything like that. We're going to be doing our first uh, after dark uh, or uh, dimly lit or whatever you want to call it uh, game stream. Uh, as everyone knows, uh, a few weeks ago, we did a game stream where we just basically played the new Rift Tracks game. And of course, everyone had a good time with that. Uh, so, but we're going to start doing that every so often. And we're just going to kind of make it a little, little side thing, you know, where we just get together and we just have a good time and we just play games the whole stream. Of course, we play them on here, but we're going to kind of do something a little bit different here and there also uh gonna start putting another uh wrestling nerd smackdown coming up to, uh soon uh i know jake jonas is interested i know skits is interested definitely uh splicer myself i will reach out to uh bran and grampy lobster as well and we will have a small panel and we will discuss uh we will discuss that uh, that nerdy part of the world uh, as pr known as professional wrestling. So uh, really, 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 really quick, we're going to say hello to everybody before we start bringing people in. There's Miss Sydney. Hello. And I see Mom is here. Hello, Mom. Good to see you. Yes, Ghost, you were on time this time. <laughs> um. Hey, Skits, good to see you. I sent you the link, bruh. If you uh, are free, uh, bring your cell phone in here. God likes to watch like a pervo? No. Um, well, maybe. I'm, I'm not sure. Um, let's, um, let's not get into that. Um, wait, what? Dang it, Skits, weren't you banned? No, he hasn't, he hasn't been banned or canceled or nothing like that uh, yet. 
but we uh, we will see here. And of course, there's Miss Cash Love as always, and Demon Orb is here. Good to see you, my friend. So first and foremost, we will bring in hmm, Brother Slim. What is up, man? How are you, sir? Doing wonderful. Thank you for letting uh, me in, and I <laughs> hope we have a fun stream and lots of fun things happen. <laughs> And there is my YouTube mentor. Greetings, good sir. And it's always good to see you here. Uh, let's see. Okay. And uh, if you don't already, please oh. go Please go and subscribe to my YouTube mentor, uh, Hatman, and his other channel, Sir Hatman. He's a gentleman and a scholar, as I always say. It's an honor to call him my friend. And uh, he is he has been one of my biggest supporters since I started doing that. And I can't thank him enough for all of the advice he's given me uh, over the time that I've been doing this. So, yes, please go and subscribe to my mentor. Tell him I sent you and uh, maybe he'll go just a little light on the punishment. But, you know, that's completely up to him. I'm just the apprentice. I get no say. So, <laughs> um, so we are counting down the days to this um, um big uh tattoo party that you got uh invited to am i correct yes uh on the 25th um there is a private hotel party with a bunch of rich people who are tattoo artists i guess and we're going to be giving them a private uh show so that will be lots of fun how many how many tattoos do you plan on getting hopefully at least three well, not all at one time, I hope. No, I'm actually hoping <laughs> to get tattooed by three different people at once. Oh, okay, okay. Yes. Uh, do, do we have locations picked out? I only have a couple spaces on my inner thigh <laughs> and uh, my my ribs, probably. So it would have to be around there. If If that's the only free spaces that you have... That brings a lot of intriguing thoughts, like um, the fact that I'm like you like you could get a tattoo on your butt cheeks. I mean, the people do it all the time, um, you know. Yeah, I, yeah. Um, I'm, try, I'm, try, I'm trying to I'm trying to fill certain places first before I go to other places. Like my genitalia will probably not be modified for 10 more years or so. Um, so. I want let's, to fill everywhere else first. Yeah, let's let no mm -mm, no let's no no yeah, that that thing. that that is that is a slight against God. There you I'm sure. sorry, I'm sorry, but I just don't believe that metal belongs anywhere near the penis or tattooing, unless or that or tattooing. A, yes, unless it's going to make me a lot of money, um, then maybe <laughs> I'll do it. Well, I mean, I mean, you do staple your penis so, I, yes i do staple my uh, cock yes jesus christ man you've got balls sir <laughs> <laughs> yes yes you have balls all right and well, next up we will bring in miss cash hello love hello how are you uh strikes and gutters ups and downs stone had beer <laughs> need to get up and go get another one but uh we are uh, in mid in the midst of show so i should have grabbed two instead of one uh, <laughs> yeah probably and no as for skits being banned he's only banned from games he's from not games banned from streams yeah no, <laughs> he's still our very close friend he's our googler and, yes he's uh, still our google yes and um, you know look at him talking shit already you know he's just like you know, my stomach chills out a bit so I can teach these people a thing or two about riff tracks. You know what? Kiss my white Irish ass. He is the master um, of that. Uh, uh, and um, hello, my queen. Hello, honey. How are you, baby? How much to stake Good. those balls? So how much to stake with the balls? $200. And I'll send you the video skits. Oh, no, no. <laughs> it's more than that. I don't need anything out of commission, please. Uh. Because it's only a couple weeks away until hopefully you will be here. Exactly. <laughs> well, then we. Well, then I guess we won't see them for a while. So uh, everyone, <laughs> everyone, take 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 it all in, soak it all up. You know, you know, snort it, smoke it, inject it, 
you know, remember it, write it down, take a picture. I don't give a fuck. Uh, but yeah, we're and, not. Uh, gonna... <laughs> if you want to see, if you want to see uh, Queen and me together, the videos and photos, all you have to do is just PayPal me money, and the more <laughs> money we make, the sooner she gets here. Yes. Oh Lord. <laughs> well, uh, have to run out, but we'll try and join when I get home. Absolutely, Mom. Okay. I sent you the all link, right, but you're always welcome, indeed. Uh, let's see. Talking about tattoos, I saw a lady that had the most badass Darth Vader back piece. Nice. That's a hell of a commitment to get Darth Vader on your entire back. Oh, yeah. yeah. Like, you've got to be like die hard, you Star know, Wars. Star Wars, like jerking off the episode, like a new hope, you know, every so uh, often. You know, right. I mean, you know, never. I mean, I mean, nothing against Star Wars. I like the original trilogy, uh, episodes one through three. If they had just got rid of Jar Jar Binks, it wouldn't have been that bad. Hey, um, what? Don't talk shit about Misa Jar Jar Binks. That is the worst fucking character they ever came up with. I love Jar Jar. He was annoying as piss. He, he's like that drunk at the bar that's a happy drunk and he just wants to stagger around and hug everybody. That's and, maybe that's why I like him because I'm that annoying happy drunk. <laughs> well, I mean, we all have that annoying happy drunk in us. I mean, just as long as you don't give me rum, I'm gonna be fine. Uh, because rum has been known to make me extremely violent and I don't that's me like with tequila. That. Well, but tequila's supposed to make your clothes come off. Oh, no, it makes my stilettos go through people's genitals. Yeah. Why are, why, why are you both, like, obsessed with, like, mutilation of the genitalia region? Well, because somebody tried touching my genitalia. Oh, so right. I, I mean, went through theirs. Oh, right. I mean, I've, I've heard the story, and trust me, it's, it's a painful experience the two times that I've heard it. Um, like, I just felt like I needed to, like, go and sit on a you know, an ice pack or something just by hearing the story. Um, because like it made my balls hurt. Um, yes. That's all the more reason to get consent. Well, this, this is true. You get consent. Your balls won't be hurting or well, yes. bleeding for that matter. Well, right. I get that, you know, but I mean, we've got, you know, slim here who does it voluntarily. And I love this man like a brother, but my God, dude, <laughs> you know, I love you, but I worry about you sometimes, you know, <laughs> I mean, a, a staple, I mean, well, okay, I'll say this. A staple, not so bad as long as you do it correctly, but at least it's not like a nail or a railroad spike or yeah. a bullet or, you know, something like that. Um, yeah. I'm sure Slim has heard of this little thing called the Pain Olympics. Yes. Okay, I've literally seen the video of where the guy shot himself in the nutsack. Oh, my God. And after that Why? moment, it's the quote unquote, like Slim, what exactly do you know about that? Like the pain Olympics, like what exactly do you know about it? You just try to go um, bigger, better and harder, right? Like just the weirder things you can do in a certain category, then you win. But what do you win? I have no idea. Like, uh, I mean, there can't be, there can't be like money involved, you know, um, because uh, honestly, yeah. I thought it was just like a Guinness Book World Record where it was just like a certificate or something. You know, because uh, honestly, when I first heard about it, I'm just like, this is going to be like some, you know, dark web shit. Like, yeah. this has got to be something like people literally go on here and, you know, paid people to see people do, you know, incredibly fucked up shit, you know, fucked up repugnant shit to themselves. But yes, yeah. Cash, to answer your question, there is a video floating around on the internet of a guy literally putting a bullet through his nutsack. Yeah. Oh my God. That's horrible. And I'm not talking about like an actual testicle. I'm just talking about like the skin on his nutsack. I don't care. That's horrible. And I will be right back. <laughs> okay. She's like, I need to go pray. Um, <laughs> sure. Yeah. All right, I'll I'll promote your I'll promote y'all's deviancy. Um, <laughs> yes, help Queen get to Slim. Go go and send Slim some money. Buy him a goddamn beer. I'm going to be doing that here uh, after I uh, 
start getting paid for my new job, which I started training for on Monday, uh, for the awesome work that he did on the intro video. He and I are going to, uh, do some brainstorming while I'm yes. off, uh, tomorrow, hope, uh, maybe tomorrow and, uh, and, and Tuesday, and we're going to get some verbiage in there. We're going to get the avatars all set up. Uh, we're also going to show some love to the, uh, to the friends, folks, and the bros around here, and uh, make sure if you don't already go and subscribe to all of the awesome people of the Brotherhood here. Uh, links are in the description. Uh, we love each and every single one of them. They've supported us so so much, and it means the world to us to have them here. Uh, and like I said, we love them dearly. So go into the description, click on the links, give them all a uh, a sub, turn on the notification bell, and. Uh, Go and see what kind of weird things go on. Trust me. I've seen shit that will turn you white. Yes. So <laughs> it's a fun, crazy, weird stuff for sure. Yeah. Let's not, let's not talk about the, you know, the, uh, the hooks and the, uh, ne well, never mind. Never mind. Exactly. Right. We'll talk about it later, Mango. <laughs> oh yeah. You know, if she goes back and listen to that, that's going in the notebook. Um, exactly. <laughs> do you have uh, do y'all have another one of those, um, planned anytime soon hello wolf. um hey hey little wolf yeah we're planning on doing another one kind of soon um uh next week at some point in time i haven't figured out when but uh hick mcdickerson's gonna come out and he's gonna talk about the flat oh, earth God. the donut earth and the hollow earth oh god yeah um yeah. <laughs> Oh, hollow. So for that. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Look, you know, now, now, now y'all know me now. I don't know a whole lot about the flat earth people and yeah. stuff like that. I mean, and it's, you know, it's like when we were on lizard stream today, like everybody thought I fell asleep. You know, it's like I always say, just because I'm not saying anything doesn't mean that I'm not paying careful attention. Of course. Yeah, because of course. that, that way, when I'm paying attention, if I, you know, have, you know, have something to say, I can make sure that like I have, you know, my ducks in a row, basically. Yeah. But I don't know Jack about these flat earth people, other than the fact that I think uh, some of them probably took way too much acid in the 60s. And um, they have been having way too many flashbacks over the last few decades. So, um, but hollow earth, yep. that just like, that makes no goddamn sense to me. Like, I, and, <laughs> I know, I know completely. Um, and then, yes, I said donut earth, a little wolf, or if I didn't say that we, we will be going over that. Um, yes. Can you, um, can, you, <laughs> can you give us a synopsis of what this is? Well, people think that the earth is in a weird, in more of a spherical um, aspect than the globe because there's a lot of spheres there, but it somehow circles and there's an inside that's hollow. And I don't know. Um, I, Hick McDickerson found a couple of vi videos on it and we're going to go over it. So, uh, yes. Oh, I, I'm, I'm pretty I, sure we're probably going to get copyright struck about the hollow earth because it comes from discovery channel, but that was the best one that I could find on the hollow earth. <laughs> well, just don't, don't, don't get a strike on your channel because of it, man. No, you they'll just be careful just, with that. Well, they'll just take us down for a second while we're um, streaming. That's the only thing that'll happen. It's not that, a big thing. You know what? That that is such a bitch because you know you get taken down for you know a number of minutes while whatever in the fuck YouTube is doing. Um, you know, it doesn't make sense to me. It's like, okay, I get it. Um, just send me an email after we're done and let the algorithm take it out. You know, don't pull me down midstream and you know you know fuck with what yeah. i'm doing yeah exactly um yeah we've had that happen a handful of times already on our streams doing crap but um we'll we'll see uh i i i have a lot of research done and i have a lot of videos saved Is sure it, it's it, it sure it is kind of like the electric universe Sorry to cut you. I didn't mean to cut you oh, off. Oh no, no, no! You're good. I, I was, I but was just going to read that. 
Yeah, yeah. So the donut earth, is it like uh, linked to the electric universe nonsense? Yes, kind of. I mean, it's kind of part of it. Yeah, no, no, it is insanely stupid. Um, all of that stuff doesn't make any sense. But um, we're going to have fun going over it. And I figure Hank McDickerson is going to be the best one to go over that. And then... Um, I'm surprised uh, that he's not going over the uh, the January 6th committee hearing. I, 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 yeah, yeah. We may go, he may go over that in the Second Amendment or gun safety in the near future. Uh, I don't know. I have a couple of black powder pistols here that I may make him go over how to use them just as a goof. About, oh, I mean, uh, like, do they actually work? Uh, I, yes. Ooh. I've, I've um, never actually, like, like, I've seen muskets, like, fired and everything, like, on TV, like, uh, you know, ballistic demonstrations and whatnot. Yeah. But, like, to actually like see one in person i've never actually seen one in person. well i mean unless it's been in like in a museum or something like yeah, that yeah. but to actually have held one or shot one which to be honest with you uh i know that a lot of those um like musket pistols or black powder pistols like one thing that they really had to watch out for was it didn't um go off on your go off in your hand because if you didn't, you know, do something correctly or, yep. you know, this, that, and the other, I mean, it would literally blow up in your hand. And they were handmade by um, people, and uh, they were kind of made uh, through a company sometimes. But you never know if the person, like, used the right type of steel, if they he heated it up properly or whatever. So back in the day, you literally would, like, have it blow up in your face and you would die from it. Um, yeah, the other cause, thing, because a lot of the guns were at like the like for the, especially for like the like the actual muskets, like the rifles and everything. That was not that was supposed to be made out of iron and not steel. Yeah. Um, the other thing is when I think everybody who gets a weapon or should, if there's going to be training, like if you start with black powder at a very young age. And then anything that anybody uses from then on is going to be very well versed in using a weapon. Because one thing that happens with black powder is it doesn't work instantly. So you sometimes have to like shoot the gun and you have to stand there for like 20, 30 seconds and then it goes off. Right. And then what you learn really quick is if it misfires, how to not point it at yourself to check. And how to dismantle right. it. <laughs> See, don't look down thing. the barrel and pull the trigger. <laughs> or don't look down the barrel after you pulled the trigger and nothing came out. Right. You know, that's a major thing that people need to realize is always if, believe something's going to come out of that chamber at all times. Right. If if you pull the trigger and nothing happens, like uh, you need to um, uh, uh, throw it and run. So. <laughs> And we'll keep well, it down we, range. Yeah, yeah. Well, we've, got a, we've got a skits and Mr. Lizard. What's up, sirs? Yeah. What's going on? Up, uh, well, we, we still see that uh, Mr. Lizard is making his pickles. Yeah, I'm still at it. I, I had to make a <laughs> second batch of brine. This one's twice as big as the last one, which was <laughs> That's what she twice said. as big as what I needed. But, <laughs> so. hey, hey, Lizard, uh, I saw your stream a while back. Was that a, a second infantry uh patch in the background or uh yeah that, that was from korea that was just like a little banner thing that i found oh uh, um, were, were you not part of the, the actual second winter i fell under the 2id but like oh. loosely because it was so it was just a umbrella i was military police so uh, okay cool yeah i didn't uh serve, got i didn't get a 2id right? patch there you go i gotcha yeah. i was with the 82nd so yeah Oh yeah, he, uh, he was he was the military bouncers. He got to throw folks in jail. My uh, cousin is actually <laughs> living in Okinawa now. He um was stationed in Okinawa, and he moved his wife down there, um and now they just live down there. That'd be, I'd be fucking love to live in uh, Korea. <laughs> that would be fucking awesome. <laughs> For real, his his box of jars. He has to move his box of jars out of the way. <laughs> That was the uh, that was actually the cucumber box. These are the fucking. <laughs> How many pounds products. did you buy? Uh, I bought thirty six individual cucumbers because they were seventy nine cents each. So instead of going by weight, which would have been. I don't know. I don't know how much. Way more uh, expensive. Grocery store yeah. or farmers market. Grocery store. 
I just, I I just got farmer's pulled. market. What Did anybody cheaper? ask yeah. you if you're gonna shooting a porn? <laughs> no. <laughs> What you yeah, saw, uh, <laughs> that's a lot of cucumbers, boy. <laughs> <laughs> it's like surprisingly not. I was a little disappointed. You know, yeah. <laughs> what's yeah, the I, name I, of the porn you're shooting? I went. I just went to the grocery store and like they only had like I think fifteen cucumbers out, and I was like, oh shit, what am I gonna do? Because I was like, I don't want to. I don't want to have to come back in the morning, which I ended up having to do anyway. Um. But I, I just went to the manager. I was like, uh, do you guys have any more cucumbers? I need 36. <laughs> and he was just like, oh, okay. So he went to the went to the fridge. He was able to grab 24 out of the fridge. And I got 12 out of the front. And then everybody could go fuck themselves in cucumbers. <laughs> I had them all. I guess so. <laughs> this weird lizard man came and bought all our cucumbers. And we don't know what he's going to do with them all. <laughs> The, it's the first. That's the first eat round. some, and the rest are probably going to be for some strange lizard human porn. <laughs> I was just about, no, I was just about to say he's going to use the rest to start his probing program. Mm. Um, they uh, apparent. I guess the the cucumbers are just to see who can uh, survive the probing and who cannot. So. Right. Um, oh, I thought much. that. Um, I thought that, that we were pickling the humans with uh, with cucumbers. No, no, no. That's the uh, next month. We'll, uh, we'll <laughs> no, the next month is, Cash, uh... Cashier sees a whole lot of cucumbers being bought by Monitor Lizard. Also, Cashier Dude must be going on the stream with Slim. <laughs> <laughs> so, you having a dungeon oh. session? <laughs> no. An extremely thirsty <laughs> just, yeah. cucumbers. Exactly. <laughs> I mean that. I mean, honestly, I, I kind of wonder how that manager felt when you just that tell told him you need thirty six cucumbers. Like, well, I, I I had like all of the other stuff, and he was just like, "Well, you're buying things, so I don't really give a fuck." He's trying to move stock, so If he would have been. If he would have been buying um, garbage bags and zip ties with that many cucumbers, then he might yeah. there might have been a couple red flags. Yeah. But, yeah. Okay, now I now wait a minute. Now I have seen something like on Facebook before. It's uh, what are three random items that you would buy at Walmart to make the cashier question what you're going to actually be doing. Oh, so let's start. Let's start. Ties. Okay, well, hang on, hang on. It, it can be anything. <laughs> like push your mind to the limit. Right. So we'll start with Slim. <laughs> Whipped cream, dog treats, and let's just let's just say uh, uh, a dog collar. <laughs> <laughs> All right, uh, lizard. All right. Uh... Other than the thirty-six cucumbers. <laughs> yeah. Right. Other than yeah. All right. Uh... Damn. No, I can't think of it. I know. No, I know. He's like, wait, I can't use the cucumbers again? Damn. (laughs) Uh, What what can I get at the store? All at the same store? Yes. Like, say, like a Walmart. It's at Walmart. Too too easy. Uh, Okay, do it. uh, A couple of of Hostess snowballs, uh, a training bra, and some lipstick. (laughs) Yes. (laughs) Fuck yeah. Oh, oh god. god damn it. Okay. <laughs> um, I'd have to say uh a tarp. Uh oh. Scary start. Painter's tarp or regular tarp? Oh no, like the giant huge Ouch. The all weather, the all weather all tarp. Weather tarp. <laughs> <laughs> what Dexter um, used as murder rooms. Like yeah, a exactly. boat cover type size type of yeah, deal. Yeah, there you <laughs> go. Okay. There you go. okay. Um either handcuffs or zip ties. Okay. And probably the dog collar <laughs> leash combo, like the the Pinch chain leash combo. <laughs> yes, there we go. <laughs> there go. Okay, it's mango. 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 Okay, mango. Here's the question. Oh, Welcome. God. Here's the question. Uh, okay. 
uh, uh, Widows, ask Mango the question. Okay, okay. Three random items that you buy at Walmart and take to the register that would make the cashier cringe and wonder what you're gonna do. Uh, or so maybe like, call the police. Or you know, or <laughs> well, maybe I like wasn't gonna you know, bring the, I like, wasn't gonna get the cops involved, but you know. <laughs> yeah, but you know, um, what what would you buy? Three things you would buy that would make people be like. Shit's going down. Shit, okay, it's let's, not gonna... let's give let's give man let's give man goo just a moment and let's. let's I know, get... I already know. Okay, uh, well, ladies perfect, first. perfect. A crowbar, a bottle of KY jelly, and a stuffed rabbit. <laughs> yes. Awesome. Wow. Nice. Okay. Okay. Really, really quick. Really quick. I want to say um, a different version of mine, and it is a snow, uh, uh, an ice maker, uh, two pieces of coal, and a carrot. <laughs> I don't know. All right. <laughs> what about you? Uh, I want to make my own snowman. Let's see here. Uh, a box of whippets, uh, some lube, and a table. Box of whippets. You can't buy, you can't buy uh, nitrogen cartridges. No, anymore. no, no. <laughs> it's just a box can of whippets. Can you not? I thought in the cooking section. No, you, you, you can, you can get them. You, oh, well, you can get them at Bed Bath oh, & Beyond, okay. I know. So I think maybe in the cooking <laughs> Oh, JL has a good one. No, you can still get the CO2 cartridges at Walmart because they are used for the airsoft guns. Yeah. Okay, th Ooh. that one's, but those ones taste you horrible. Don't, never, don't use those to yeah. suck down. Please, kids, don't. don't. don't it, just, <laughs> like, just like the ones for cars that are made for the nitrous, you know, the, no, the no, engine. No, 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 no. Never, oh, no, 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 don't no, no. Use I'm those. talking about... <laughs> The no, but you can get the whipped cream yeah, no, containers there. Yeah, and that's, the, that's what I'm talking about. Yeah, the you cracker. can get the CO2 cartridges and the whipped cream containers at Walmart. Oh. Yeah. Uh, I know you can get a like a regular, like a uh, what they call a cracker. Yeah. Like you put a uh, balloon at the end of one hey, of them and crack hey. the cartridge. That is they racist. They have those at the sex shop. <laughs> we, we, we call them... <laughs> We we call them tool. We call them white tools. I guess I don't we know call we that. call them we call them American white uh, 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 yeah, devices. No, I'm just kidding. No, <laughs> actually, they have those. They have the crackers at the sex shop down the street. <laughs> All yeah. right. So yeah. my my three would be logging chain. Um. Take your time. <laughs> I will. God damn it. Um, You've been thinking about this the longest. Like, I was right on it. What the I've, been listening, I've been listening <laughs> to everybody's <laughs> answers. I mean, come on, man. Um, okay, so logging chain, potting soil, and vegetable oil. So you're building a bomb. Blammo. Oh, I said potting soil, not fertilizer. I mean, you can get potting soil okay, that has fertilizer okay. in it. Yeah. Well, I, mean, I, I don't think you can I'm really a... build a bomb out of out of uh, logging chain and... Uh... You can do anything <laughs> yeah. if you try hard enough. Drop in the nitrates <laughs> out of the soil. Put your mind right. to it. <laughs> I, mean, I mean, you just... I mean, honestly, you walk up with like five foot of logging chain, a bag of like potting soil or peat moss and you know some vegetable oil i mean you're either into some really weird shit or these are just happen to be the items you need i mean come what's, on what's 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 the harshest chemical that you can buy at walmart mm, probably, like uh, Drano. probably Drano. some kind of solvent yeah, Drano is pretty hardcore. Okay, okay. So if you if you just like walked up with like an armful of Drano, a shovel, and like <laughs> no, if you mix, walking up a with like a pot or something, you know, like, like go, yeah, go to Home Depot and walk up with like a few bags of lye, a shovel, yeah, 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 and yeah. a painter's tarp. You know, yeah, yeah. Uh, there you go. <laughs> then they would probably call the cops. Do do um, they, do they do they have a do they have an incinerator or really, really <laughs> high uh, uh, a heat uh, uh, chimney or stove or something? Does just this walk up? Is this saw capable of cutting through a human sternum? Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. Can I cut through a femur with this hacksaw? Say, say I had a really big deer, wink, wink, nudge, nudge, and I needed to cut through uh, it. Uh, would this you know, work? <laughs> would this suffice? Oh, God, Ox. So I have actually heard about um, people going to um, hunting stores and asking how to cut up 
and dissect um, large game and they buy all the products. And then two months later, they end up like getting uh, caught by the FBI, like murdering their significant other, dropping them in the woods. <laughs> yeah. Because they well, think was... like, oh, that's going to work. But no, oh, they yeah, have a so. paper trail, dummy. If you, unless, unless you steal your best friend's credit card or you like, you know, make them a fake alias. Or you pay, like wear a cops... mask because they're fucking recording you too. Like, right. Well, yeah. yeah, but not, but not just Does that. Does this heavy like, duty like... bottle of Drano work? Prob yes. Probably, Put probably that down. for a foot, for a foot. <laughs> no. But th these people literally she, will. She these jumped people, on that really quick. She, she right. does. I have she one too, Queen. Now up. I'm scared. Now I'm scared of her coming over. No, I'm <laughs> scared. <Yeah>. Um, <laughs> no, no, no. What it's gonna be? Yeah, what it's gonna be My like is that scene. It's going to be like that scene in Terminator 2 where Sarah Connor like puts that needle into the Drano, draws it out, and then sticks it in that guy's neck and threatens to uh, inject him with it. Yeah. No, no. that I'm not like that. I'm not that crazy. No, she that won't stick it in my neck first. She'll hold it, she'll hold it, she'll hold anyways, it to my um, neck. Not, oh, never mind. <laughs> um, no, believe it or not. I, I had to buy that and it didn't even work to unclog the damn drain. Oh, of course. Of the sink down here because somebody decided to wash plaster and paint and all types of other shit down that drain. And now I just have to replace the damn drain because nothing. Can you not, yeah, can you not yeah. get a uh, snake? Like a plumbing snake? No, it's, it's there's uh, cement that. basically. Everything, in here. Oh, yeah. everything's yeah, it's everything's ruined it down Jeez, there, unfortunately. That's fucked up, man. Yeah, they won't that there's nothing they can fix. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, we also have to remind ourselves about how many body parts that Lizard like has had to flush down his drain and toilet. Exactly, and exactly. All of that oh, over yeah. the years. Oh I yeah, Lizard, do you I have any know. um um suggestions for me? I uh <laughs> <laughs> No. Oh, well, so I can you, typically like digest most things like bone, heavy meats. Um, urine, I will make I will make her bow. So. I'll make her bow later. Don't worry. Um, the really funny thing is, is when I go to buy um, implements for my sideshow, um, like grinders, grinder pads, um, meat hooks, fish hooks, or shark hooks, or whatever, or different like animal traps and stuff. You know how funny it is. For me to like walk up to like places to like buy all these like weird crazy things and people are like looking down and looking at me and going, "Are you gonna be on the news later?" You know, like, <laughs> like, like somebody looks like me is buying like animal traps and huge hooks and all that shit, and they're just like, "Is murder gonna happen?" <laughs> a package of sandpaper, a bottle of Robitussin, oh. and a copy of Fifty Shades of Grey. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, no, the man. thing is how they point you out. You gotta buy the Bible. Here. Uh, <laughs> what, what was That'll get you caught quicker. What are you oh, talking what? about? <laughs> Falling down the down a hill or something. Yeah, you might. You got a lot of yeah. Yeah, you got a lot of scratching going on. Yeah. Yeah. What you do is you rip out the <laughs> you rip the cover of Fifty Shades off and then take the insides of the Bible out and just put the two together and you're you're good to go. You know what I hate? You know what I really hated about Fifty Shades of Grey working at a porn store? Is that better? Everybody See, thought everything it was, about yeah. it? Yeah, yeah. That's, that's that's better than what it is. Everybody came in asking for things that don't exist and asking like right. how things work that aren't oh, real. Yeah. Right. They're like they're like they're like, excuse me, Sonny, where's the contract that we signed to like have my um my uh my uh uh the the lawn boy or whoever um you know you know like you're like no those what? things don't Slim, exist. you should have just typed one up and sold each copy too. for 50 bucks no right. i totally you should have figured out something and then they come in and they'd <laughs> yeah. say um what what's this little egg thing that you're supposed to put in your vagina and like uh, it was explained none. wrong no. None. no i know yeah yeah no no, no they eggs. didn't do not put eggs she, in your vagina yeah no no she she explained kegels wrong she you didn't know, know honestly, that there's the two balls that go in there. They you when, know, she, when you she when said you, you had somebody like when you had somebody like that come in, you should have just pointed at the door and be like, "Get the hell out of my store." Oh, <laughs> to be fair though, the egg thing may have come from Gwyneth Paltrow because she no, sells those uh, jade eggs. Yeah, it, and she does she tell got, them to kegel with it. She she got the idea from Fifty Shades. There well, was no such thing of an egg product like vagina. that you put. Oh God. Uh, but now her little friend too is so now there's a candle that smells like her and her friend's vagina. 
So it's not just it's terrible. Not terrible, by the way, you guys. There's there's the challenge for your it's, next it's charity. Queef. It's you queef. raise enough money, you have to buy a Gwyneth Paltrow candle and burn it and the entire to... stream. Oh, and <laughs> uh, oh my god! I'm sorry, you guys. I don't think he wants to drop three hundred dollars on a vagina scented candle. No, I did. But... I did however, about that. I did, however, drop seventy five dollars on a okay, mystery open box, it. and I totally forgot to open this on my stream. So well, you uh, how open dare it you steal my idea? Yeah, do Fuck it. yeah! Do it. Yeah. Well, okay. We're gonna we're gonna give the floor to uh, Mr. Lizard for oh. a few moments. <laughs> All right, and we'll let him this, open his package. This one was. Show <laughs> <his package. laughs> It was heavy. I was wondering what it was because it's definitely multiple things. So it looks like it's, it's a scream costume it's... and a dildo. <laughs> <laughs> it's all Holy three shit, things that he wanted in priority. Walmart. It's it's a bunch of shawls. Wait, what? It's a bunch of what? Shawls? Shawls? Yeah. Scarf? Shawl? Oh, hold on. Now you can dress up like a priest. I was gonna go with like a Middle Eastern woman. Yeah, yeah. Oh, there you go. I was about to, there's there's he a can lot of one. Muslim women that live here, so like they probably ordered themselves a whole bunch of <laughs> see, <laughs> job covers. Did you see it sparkle? Oh, that, <laughs> yeah, dude. That's lizard. Lizard like lizard like sparkles on it. Are these... Okay, I see Lizard giving those away to the women on his streams. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, it's, for it's real. a gypsy. It's a gypsy outfit. He's gonna put it on and do a dance for us. Yeah, he's gonna oh, belly dance for us, folks. Send it to Slim so I can wear it on our streams. Oh, yeah, there we go. Perfect. <laughs> Perfect. I feel like I think these are actually like hijabs. I don't know. Yeah. They probably they, are. They, could they be, are based yeah. on where. Based on where the beating is, those are yeah. the coverings for hijab. Can you hold the beat? Can you yeah. hold the beating up to the camera for real quick, bro? Hold on one sec. He's okay. trying to fold it back up. Well, I was trying to. I was trying to see the what you call it tag. Yeah. Oh, that's yeah. That's those are hijabs. These yeah. these are actually not not very bad. Like it's, that is my grandma's dress. Cereal, How did you get my grandma's like, dress? No, I'm just. kidding. Like, Lizard, you have to send okay. one to Cookie, man. <laughs> oh, God, yes. <laughs> yeah, I'll, uh, I'll send these Can out. I'll, I'll, we'll do these for like maybe a trivia prizes. Shit, there we <laughs> I go. don't know. There you go. Nice. Of a ladies' night, everybody gets a good job. We'll do. There you go. Middle Eastern trivia. How, how much, I, I have to know how much did how much did the mystery wasted. package cost you? In total, seventy five dollars. Yeah, the I don't know. Yeah. Okay, That's and expensive ass scarves. Well, there was a bunch of stuff in there, and one of the things I got is a like a nipple for breastfeeding. So <laughs> 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 no, no, actually, like you to, like try it all, your... you? It, no, it's one of those uh, self weaning <laughs> nipples. Yeah, yeah. Cashes. It's a self weaning yeah. nipple. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. So, like, I got what that, lizard's gonna then... do with that? I I don't want to know, oh, but uh... throw well, it out. He's quick. gonna throw it out. Like, ooh. like real quick before I, I have, right? Well, I have to know, like, what time soon? So it should go to Skits Crasher. Send it to Skits. Yeah. Um, <laughs> like, I have to know, lizard. What went through your mind when you saw that? I think he went to go get it. <laughs> I probably did. <laughs> Please, he did. I want to see this. Actually, like, really fucking cool. And I will like, take it if nobody else is, honestly, because I love stupid, yeah. crazy, weird. I, so. I'm thinking about. I, I was thinking about keeping the box. The box says like. <laughs> I don't, it's, can we show this? It's, it's, it's <laughs> well, yeah, you can, you can show it yeah. right there. It's just. Oh, oh so it's like a. That. Oh, never mind. Oh. Yeah, and then oh, okay. what? The interesting thing I saw on it was like it's got all the Chinese characters, but it's a food item. So instead of a fork and knife, if it'll focus. It's got a spoon and chopsticks. Um, <laughs> so it's, so it's yeah. put, your, put your hand in front of it. Put your hand in front of it and then Hold let on, it we're show. Boiling. <laughs> we're boiling. We're boiling, <laughs> boy. We're boiling, folks. Boy, I got oh. some boil on. Oh. Okay. Oh. Um, so... Easy now. Whoa. Oh, they're Ooh, doggy. Right. Oh, boy. <laughs> Whoa, they're <a> cucumber. <laughs> <laughs> Down yeah, boy. We'll, yeah. let that, we'll let that get boiling a little bit more. Got to move it around. 
So what kind of pickles? I, ima- are I imagine. Baby, that's, I would you're, imagine you're that's muted. also muted, baby. You're muted. I would al- also imagine that that is uh, the pot that uh, lizard would fry a turkey in. Also, I have never fried. Put your, a hand, put your hand. Put your hand in front of it and then try. Yeah, hold on. Let me see. Right. Lizard skin, folks. That's, his, yeah. that's his there. Pot. It is. Yeah. Well. Yeah. That's his oh, on the right yeah. there, the spoon and chopsticks. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah you yeah. can kind of see it. You guys get the idea. Yeah, yeah totally. We, we do. I wanted to get one of those packages, like one of the bigger ones, but I'm gonna. I'm trying to save my money, so <laughs> I'll wait until after I come home and then I'll order one. Yes. Once once the visit is over. <laughs> Mango, then... I I missed your <laughs> unboxing. What yeah. did you What did you get? Well, uh, I have her right beside me. She is Sassy Nana. Nana. (laughs) Wow. It's someone's grandmother as a necklace. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's pretty cool. I like that. That's random. That's certainly random, but, I mean, it's something you probably hang on to. Nobody came forward yet? I haven't gone on the hunt for Sassy Nana yet. I'm on the hunt for the owner of, uh... This keychain, it's got oh yeah, a oh, yeah, selfie on it and music. like their song on it. That's weird. Oh That's yeah, weird. it's interesting. But what's the name of the group in the song? Uh, the song is called "The One." Lil Dirk and uh, D E J Loaf. I don't want to mispronounce that. I don't know if they go okay, by Day. Mango, day. I, okay, Mango. I have a question. Is that a Battletoads flag behind you? Uh, no, that is my Battletoads binder full of Gen 1 Pokemon cards. Uh, Battletoads are awesome. I Damn love it. Battletoads. Gen 1. That game I used so to much have the there. Double Dragon Battletoads Sega game. Ooh, nice. Actually, I still have it. It's just in my mother's attic. Oh, right yeah. Now. Lizard, how goes your hunt for your N64? Because I can still find you one here. I have not looked for a second. Oh, oh. <laughs> I haven't had before. Oh, damn you, man. I've been, oh my I've been uh, busy doing other things, unfortunately. So they went on the back burner. I wow. like pickles. There's also some Gin 2 in there, but like, I was way more into Gin 1. Yeah. Uh, I, yeah wish I, had, I wish I had more money to buy magic cards. Cash, we ha- you have to get those. I have a lot of work I to do. I haven't been to my mother's. I know, I know, I know. I'm just saying I have a lot of work to do. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, I offer no cash has told me she has a ton of magic cards and I have volunteered. Yeah, to go I have something every like single- ten thousand or a hundred thousand. I have Christ. volunteered to go through every one of them and price them. I'll pull out the most expensive ones and separate them from the rest. My payment in return is I get my choice out of what's left. Yes. Okay. Out of every box. <laughs> Mango incoming. Incoming. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, what happened? She's talking they're talking they're talking bad about us, man. That's what they're doing. Uh-oh. They're all doing that. Yeah. Okay, so the moderator. <laughs> <laughs> So, Lizard, where are you? Are you making these pickles for yourself, or are you selling them? I'm gonna sell these. So, each one's gonna be about uh, be about ten bucks plus shipping. Awesome. Uh, I already agreed with Cash's to. She was like, "I'll pay the shipping." So, uh, yep. That was that was made before I made. made that. A, so, I can pay the ten dollars and the shipping, hon. It's not it's, that big a deal. Son of a bitch, that's hot. Um, Especially with you burning yourself so much. <laughs> no, it's, it's all good. Um, we'll what kind are they? Out, but, um, what kind of pickles just, are you making? These are spicy dill. They're dill Cash and garlic. Is um, the, they're the, Mango nice. has the recipe in her. Uh, they're lizard people pickles. That's all you need to know. <laughs> Basically. Um, God damn you both. They're called they're so, called LPs, folks. LPs. Sp- yeah, spicy yeah. LPs. <laughs> Those are people and I, people. and and these two are getting very mischievous over here. Like I, I, know, I mean I know. Like we're, I don't we're not planning anything yet. Yeah. We yeah. know that you're Lies. planning to take over the world. Yeah, 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 no, yeah. We know. Just, you know, oh. just I, you know, just as long just as long as I God can it, like Cash. be involved, watch or videotape it. <laughs> Um, you know, but you know, uh, you know, there's always options. So speaking <laughs> of that devil, should we play a game? 
Um, uh, Lizard, I'm actually, if you can do a few probably non-spicy, I mean, <coughs> my mom would buy one from you. Yeah, I, I, uh, I plan on doing plenty of non-spicy ones. I've still got six cucumbers and 12 jars, so I got plenty of room to do it. I'm going to have brine left over as well, so like... Uh, Honey, I got a cucumber for you. <laughs> no, no, no. Remember, remember, lizard loves peanut. It's true. Peanut. Honey, I got some peanuts for you. No, I wasn't. I'm right here, honey. <laughs> <laughs> what? In the Cash, are you okay? Hey, you mentioned peanut. I almost. <laughs> <laughs> But he loves me so much. <laughs> just, just don't mention the baby carrot. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> oh, but wait a minute. I, have, I hadn't heard that Peanut was stolen from you. What happened? Mm. A BGTV's a dick. <laughs> yeah, she was stolen by a black man. Oh, God. Oh, no, 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 cheese no. and rice. <clears throat> oh, God. Cancel. Cancel. <laughs> Well, canceled well, over here. I can't get canceled if it's true. That's very... I'm just saying, honey, you're gonna you're gonna get canceled over here. <laughs> Wish Brand was here. Brand does it so much better than me. Yeah. <laughs> oh my God. Uh, I thought I I, I could have. I think I heard you mention something about it when you were. I think when you were in the geek room the last time, maybe. Um, oh, chasing the dog. Mm -hmm. Sorry. Oh, but no. Um, I'm. The long and short of it is, she owes him thirty-five dollars for the bowling alley deposit. What? For the reception, like it's the same one that we do. Uh, you know, our we... sex addicts anonymous meeting in that one. Mango, since you and I are both ordained in the Church of Latter-day Dude. I had already we... volunteered to ordain. Well, and, no, uh, I was going to say could we, we should throw him a uh, Big Lebowski themed wedding in the bowling alley. <laughs> but he's not getting married anymore. Well, I know yeah. that, but if they had been, that's what I'm saying. Whoa! Mm. Oh, Lizard and Peanut. It was a whole thing. It was Nutgate. <clears throat> oh, oh, damn. <laughs> Lizard, I'm starting to like, think a lot differently of you, sweetheart. Uh, no, um, see, every time I did a stream while he was at work, I would perpetuate the lie that he was yeah. going to get married to Peanut because he yes, couldn't answer true. because he was at work. Yeah. Yeah. And All he was I said listening. Was, I don't hate her voice. That's it. Yeah, I know. Now I know. <laughs> no, now you're not getting married. Damn dog. Can you imagine? <laughs> Can Give you imagine a lizard him. peanut? <laughs> See, yeah, I brought that up one you... time in his chat, and uh, he timed me out. <laughs> <laughs> well, Mango, Mango, you're safe here. You can mention it all you want because uh... he can't time you out here. <laughs> Is there such thing as a peanut lizard? We should definitely look that up. Is <laughs> or, or would it be a lizard peanut? I'm not about to look that up peanut? because, like, rule thirty four. No. Yeah. Wait, wait, no. Rule what? Rule 34. Oh, you're right. It's probably 34? a porn. Oh, you don't know what rule 34 is? There is porn of it. Yeah. Yeah. Wait, I, I, wait, I'm, uh, Lizard started his one man band again. I'm still waiting for my copy of the demo. Um, oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> like I said, this is what we were just, we were just going to be kicking back and just having fun today. This we can, we can. We can remix Lizard if you want. Hold on. Stop. Do don't it. Lizard, don't dance in front of the camera. It's scary. I, 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 uh, I am far too white to dance. <laughs> he hasn't have an, he hasn't had enough he hasn't had uh, enough white claws yet. This is very true. <laughs> he, need, he 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 needs to be drinking some real beer is what he needs to be doing. Hey. <laughs> but real beers are like super heavy on the tummy. Like, I yeah, I know, but real tummy. beers are delicious. <laughs> <laughs> oh, does Lizard have a sensitive tummy? Oh, don't talk about tummy. <laughs> hey, I don't know if you know. Yeah, he, ate some bad, he ate some bad uh, 
uh, oh. <laughs> Chettis the other day. And, that, well, um, no, what I was about to say, that's flashbacks back to the Cobes meal. He ate some bad peanuts oh. the other Don't day. Don't you ever and... bring that up. <laughs> okay, uh, all right. Mango he wants can, to kill me now. He can bring it up if he eats a fucking Mountain Dew egg. Do oh, it. my God. Fuck yeah. those eggs. Fuck those eggs. Yeah, yeah, right. yeah, no. Hey, not. who wants to watch a Cobes cooking video? Now that I can oh, share man. my screen, huh? Let's do it. Nice. We've already been grossed out today. So let's just nice continue. deflection, bro. <laughs> what, am I, what, am I, what am I deflecting here? No, right now I'm basically just trying to keep Mango from getting Listen. mad at me because she's because the moment I brought up the meal, uh, I got very afraid. <laughs> 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 okay. Lizard has lizard has As a ghost in his kitchen. Yes. What me? You should kitchen be afraid. Talented, folks. It's hot as shit. I, I apparently have made Mango mad. Everybody, I'm sorry. Oh no. Uh oh. What did you do? Uh, I brought up I, I brought up food, bad food. Yeah, and, and no, you brought clothes? up the Cobes meal specifically. And like every time I think about it, my arms get super heavy again. I, oh, I have like I, flashbacks I was, to that. It's terrible. <clears throat> so can I was, explain I was not aware is? of that, uh, Miss Mango, oh. and I apologize. Do you want to? Do you want to? Do you want to show them the uh, us eating the meal? To, oh, to, to oh no! Oh. Are you trying to kill Mango? Yeah, know, we're not huh? going to do that. <laughs> no, let's just let's watch Cobes do something stupid. Let's just right, watch Cobes make something else. Ooh, that one steak that he made was a little creepy. Creepy steak. Uh, what's, the, what's the name of that channel where it's just his cooking videos, but like condensed? Um, you, there's a couple. One of them is Lennon Lime. And then there's uh, another one. I forget. You know, I think I sure found... Mango knows. <laughs> Uh, Poor mango. Poor mango. Wait, what are we looking know. for? I, I was looking for the, um, the channel like that has the condensed cob oh, cooking uh, videos. Bite sized cobes. Yeah, or, that's what it was. Bite yeah. sized cobra bits, something like that. The archives of his. Ah, here we go. Okay, so let me oh, pull this up nice. here. Right. It's so nice to be able to screen share properly. Yes. Right. Okay, so everyone can see, yes? Yes. 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 I didn't even look, but yeah, sure, why not? <laughs> <laughs> It's definitely showing. Okay, let's see here. We have uh, honey mustard beer ribs. Uh, wait a minute. Or, let me check the playlist because this is a, a um, lot through. Honey mustard beer ribs. I mean, I I uh, want to just go with those. I think it's not a bad idea. Now. Oh, it's gonna get worse, dude. Are we gonna, oh, okay. okay, we have a um, deep fried avocado. I guess that's deep fried avocados. Uh, mm -hmm. Cheeseburger pizza calzone. You know, coming from somebody myself who still eats MREs when he's too lazy to cook a meal, <laughs> this sounds terrible. Yeah. Uh, we have cook, um, something called Cook's Another Burger. We have an apple pie. A breakfast calzone. Breakfast calzone. We were breakfast calzone. Yeah, sure. omelets sure, earlier. Sure, sure, yeah, yeah, yeah. Greasy. What's cracking, you two? What's up? What up? What's crack a lacking? Got the weekend munchies going on. Dude, this guy's creepy looking. Well, well, let's see if I can oblige with that. What? Because we need a pizza stone. What are we doing with that? We're gonna make a breakfast calzone. What's with the hands? Okay, what's the cobra, man? What's up? Of course, I like that shirt. That's how his hands go. always the fun part. Wait, do what? What now? Oh, like, he asked about just... Cobes' hands, and I was like, he's always drunk. That's just how his hands go. Uh, oh, fair <laughs> enough. I was like, it's, yeah. like, it's like doing some weird like symbols going on there, right? 
He has the word. He has Ozzy's name tattooed on the wrong fucking hand. Yep. Really? It. He may have mirrored this, and well, I don't know. I don't know. Oh no! It, it, it is on the wrong does. hand. <laughs> yeah. Bastardizing fuck. All right. Cobes, let me give you a piece of advice. Piece of advice, my dude. Um, there's a little tab that has the paper, and it says press here. Jesus and right. And if you press on that spot, that can will pop. Yep. Potty mouth over time. here. Okay. Get out of there, you bastard. I don't edit my videos. Oh, well, <laughs> that's not real. This Did you just do that life. after a jump cut? Sitting here <laughs> fucking with the <laughs> somebody, it's somebody else's up. video. Oh. Yeah. yeah, somebody, <laughs> some, somebody basically no, took like the because his his video, like his cooking videos, or could be like in multiple small parts, or like even like what 15, 20 minutes maybe longer. I thought he did. Uh, he long, does like long. two, three hour cooking streams. Where yeah, he's just like talking while yeah, doing yeah. shit. I, yeah. I've I've never watched a, a a full like stream of Cobes ever. Um, I'm most of the time what I see is like on the geek room and, and shit like that. Yeah, it's all the cut up videos that you're seeing. But no, he does like hour long videos or multiple hour long videos. Just a little bit. Okay, now is that seasonings? Cage free, 18 large, cage free brown eggs. I prefer cage free YouTube because I'm an animal lover. Okay, now let's let's take a moment to once again appreciate the fact and the footprints on the wall. Um, <laughs> I mean, what? if you don't have, I mean. Buy a goddamn fly swatter, or well, will you please pause or something? It's, and anybody else in the side chat know why there are footprints on the wall? He's smashing yeah, bugs, killing bugs, literally, yeah. With yeah, his it's killing bugs with his, with boots, his boots on the wall. That's mm -hmm. what those marks are. Oh my Don't god! Don't derp and cook. <laughs> now, just Don't remember, you guys. This is from his old apartment. He does not live in this one anymore. Yeah. So. Uh, no more boot prints, at least. At least that we know of. Now. <laughs> that we know. Still of. got the chunky pans, though. So we got our two eggs. <laughs> so ways you could do these. Now what I'm doing is I'm taking that melted butter and just kind of spreading it all over the pan. This will give us a nice, delicious, greasy surface to work with. That's a fucking dog collar, man. Ew. Oh, my God. Dude. Uh, okay. If you're not getting hungry now, you're about to be getting uh, all flavor, folks. Making... Okay, no, no, no. Oh. The simple fact that he does not understand how to really use cast iron just pisses me the fuck off. Yeah. yeah. Just because it's cast iron doesn't mean you never even wipe it down. No, no, no. <laughs> I guarantee you that this motherfucker right here, I guarantee you that he washes it with soap oh, and water. Oh, like he's straight up like, okay, gotcha. Yeah, yeah like he, he performs the cardinal sin of yeah. cast iron. You do not wash it with soap and water. You rinse it out, you wipe it out, and you put it away. because it's He doesn't wash never, his cast iron. No, no. My mom washes hers, but she re-seasons it every time. That's but that's not necessary. She same. puts it in. The, she reseasons it, puts it in the oven on like 500 degrees, and because you're supposed we to. We all just need like Cobes' cast iron is seasoned with all of the meals that he's had before. Yeah, that's disgusting. Yeah, that. Yeah, that's. He doesn't gross, wash it. Man. He doesn't do anything with it. He's you know what I gotta say? Days at a time. Well, you know what I gotta say is y'all need Jesus. Let's keep watching. Know. You you need Jesus. Y'all um, need Jesus. But, but no, actually, <laughs> quick, I was I actually was having a conversation about uh, about this with my mother because um, she came to visit me today, and there's a, a little curb market not too far from where I live, and she wanted to stop and get some like tomatoes and cantaloupe and stuff, and they had. Uh, she said she was going to buy some okra, and I had mentioned I had not had like you know homemade done fried okra in a long time and she still has all my mama's old cast iron and she was telling me that what my mama would do when she was done she would you know get the grease out of it 
you know, rent, put very, like very little water into it and then wipe it out and put it away. But then after a certain point, what you're supposed to do is you're actually supposed to build, uh, they say you can build like a, a campfire or a bonfire and throw your cast iron off in it and it'll burn off all of that residue. And then you Polymerized. can memorize Right. And then you can reseason it and keep using it. Um, which she's act, which she actually saw my, my mom all do a few times. Um, so yeah, that's, Oh God. It just disturbs me when people use ass uh, uh, when people use cast iron incorrect a, uh, ass iron. I guess is what ass I was iron. Saying. <laughs> yeah. Ass iron. Ass iron. Can dankness. Yeah, dankness, All folks. Right, Are these the double yolk try. eggs? Some of them that. might have double yolks. Trip down. It looks like just the, uh, the extra store. large that. eggs that you can get. Dude, Dude no. Oh, that is vile. Oh, so dirty and disgusting. Dude, he's eating bits of his last three meals. Well, uh, and, and not only all that, of the meals, it, not the last three. Oh. Last twenty meals. It's so like not so only gross, that, but he used dude. way too much butter. That's way a lot of grease. He's deep frying his eggs. Exactly. <laughs> Poor Slim just can we just, turned his camera off because can we admire that stove top right there? Yeah. Yeah, let's let's take a moment yeah. to appreciate this here. Oh you know, my and food poisoning just this got here. worse. Fuck and God. let's this let's not forget this wonderful shot of this dirty grease here, folks. You know what's odd um, to me? Every oh, time we've is... seen Cobes stream from his living room, it's clean he vacuums he puts things away like he's a very much a clean person outside of the kitchen how let's uh, uh yeah. let's not forget question. this dirt over here on the wall oh uh, yes no but i mean like well, if you go look at more recent videos like when he's in his living room getting drunk just ranting it's clean it's vacuumed looks nice he also he did also spill stroming juice on his floor Oh, uh, this was uh, at this apartment, actually, not the new one. Lizard okay. question. Are you going to be doing regular deals or any sweet deals? No, just regular deals. Garlic dill, brine, pickles. They'll be good. Don't worry. You're alone. I can well, attest no. they're amazing. No, my mom, my mom was asking if they were sweet pickles or dill pickles. So They're, they're just uh, regular dill. Ever do any bread and butters? No, I've only oh, ever done and this, nasty. this recipe. Oh, how dare you, communist! I mean, I'll eat. I'll wait, eat what? Bread and so <laughs> wait, 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 wait! Hold, hold, hold on, hold, hold the phone. Did you just call me a communist because I don't like bread and butter pickles? He did. I did. <laughs> I just bring, said, "How dare you!" I'm bringing back McCarthyism hardcore. What's the what? How much? How much you uh, want to bet that Skits has a uh, tattoo of Senator Joseph McCarthy tattooed on his ass? Oh, um, my taint. Oh Jesus! <laughs> no, no, he has he has Nixon tattooed on his taint. <laughs> he's got Nixon tattooed on his taint. He's got McCarthy on his right butt cheek, and he's got Donald Trump around his asshole. Oh, you know it. <laughs> Make assholes great again. And I, uh, um, I, you deny I wouldn't my know. fans what they come to see. Oh, that's what that. Well, is this bacon? Mm -hmm. What is that? That's is that ham or bacon? Can't be bacon. It, it's uh, supposed to be bacon. Uh, no. Lizard, my my mother said that she will take one jar. Just uh, send me the information on how to get them, and I'll take care of it when I can. I'll take care of it as soon as possible. Absolutely, I can. I can do non, that. Uh, these have to these non spicy. Do, non spicy. These ones. These have to cure for six weeks. Oh, uh, that, uh, that's empty. fine. That's fine. Just when they're ready, <laughs> let me know. And she Absolutely. would like a, a jar of the regular dill pickles. Oh, hey, Jello. Hey, I will one hundred percent send them out for sure. What's up, brother Jello? Okay, Jell so <clears throat> uh, Jello, I do believe I sent you the link if you want to uh, join us while we oh, watch dang. some roast cobes. <laughs> Let's put some Doritos in the grease, folks. <laughs> Doritos in the grease. Done. Ew. 
Here's that burger. Okay. What is the burger for? It, he's making. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, it's for flavor, duh. Texture or something. Mm -hmm. I took my spatula. We're still pretty sure that uh, Cobes can only like Grab go by texture. Drip it on Not the yeah. dough. Yeah. That's true. I Just forget about that sometimes. So now I got our tomato, basil, garlic, the same sauce. We've seen it before. Beautiful. Oh, no. That's sliced uh, with the cheddar. That's so Making that life better. Pizza Could sauce. It... Oh, kiss my ass, you fuck. Oh, my God. God sausage. damn it. Boo. Spread the jello, you're lame. What? <laughs> I'll enjoy I'm from here, y'all. Pretty full. <laughs> no problem. So uh, if you if you change your mind, the link is in your DMs. Please come and so join us, my friend. You're always welcome. You please, I want to tear it up. It's good stuff, man. What? Take a look at all that delicious cheese. What okay, first of all, heart. Okay, first of all, you did not spread the sauce around accordingly. Second of all, you don't put sliced goddamn cheese on a fucking pizza. Third, That's not supposed to be a pizza. It's supposed to be a calzone, and you don't well, put the okay. sauce in the calzone, oh, and it's supposed to have ricotta cheese. No, you can't put. Now, I, I've had calzones with sauce inside them, yes. Ew. They're fake. They're not real. Fake right. Calzone. Fox's Pizza lied to me. Fox's Pizza is fucking delicious, too. <laughs> Say otherwise, and I'll, I'll come show you different. Uh, Lizard, my mother <laughs> says thank you, and to oh, make sure absolutely. you let me know when they are ready. Tell your, tell your mother I will absolutely do that with that she's a peach. She's a sweetheart. I will. I will. She, she was at. She was like, "Who's making them?" And I said, "Lizard." He's, he's like doing it right now. <laughs> I'm ladling. I got the last little ladle right there, and that's it. Oh my, <laughs> my, my! I know my mom is probably going to be. I know what she's probably going to be doing tomorrow, and that's sitting at home and uh, doing fresh uh, green bees, like snap peas. Like <gasps> she bought. A, she bought like. Um, I think she bought like the last like half, like quarter pound or whatever, like however they measure it, you know, of them. And so I think tomorrow she's probably going to be making, uh, getting ready to make some fresh green beans. So I want to throw in our pepperoni. Here First we go. Time, friends over at Frito Lay. Of course, the Doritos. Yeah, let's add our okay, egg. okay, quick question. Has anyone here, besides eating Doritos straight out of the bag, or like a Dorito taco from Taco Bell, have you ever put Doritos on anything else? Yes. No. What? Uh, during the summer, after we would go swimming, we would put them on our like ham and cheese sandwiches. Now that's no, I've done that. That's, that's different. That's, that's a sandwich. <laughs> I've actually put the nacho cheese ones on a peanut butter sandwich. That's really good. Ew. No, no like, that works. Nothing cooked though. Well, I know that, but what I'm just saying, have you used them on any like anything else besides just eating them out of the bag? It'd be cooked or not? Um, uh, no, I also can't eat Doritos to this day. <laughs> I can't do it anymore. I Crush can't. Cool Ranch Doritos make great deep fried breading. Th now that is true. Now I have had I have had that uh, done before. That's actually really really good. Um, you don't see it now. I've I've also seen it done with the nacho cheese um, Doritos, but I've never I've never tried it. But I've heard it's amazing. Oh no, yeah, Jello's right. I've actually taken the cool I, that is right. I've actually taken the Cool Ranch Doritos and used it as the breading for um chicken fingers, homemade chicken fingers. Oh wow. Oh, okay. that, uh, now that sounds dank. Now that, yeah, that sounds would, dank. That would be dank. Drop it on there. Oh, wait. oh yeah, that's the egg. Egg. We're just drop it in there like that. Oh. On top of our egg, we're gonna take the bacon we just made that cooked bacon into bits and we're just going to tear it up 
and put it How on I'm even eating our... right Ew. now, I have no idea. Take a look. Ew, that is so gross. I'm, I'm waiting to see if drunk. Or add oh, dude, that burger's not even fucking down. cooked. Look at that shit. <clears throat> But remember, Look it's going to go into the oven for an improper amount of time. Right. Why? But, but still, I mean, look at this. This is... Ah, fuck. Well, I mean... Because how, of how dirty his pan is, like, it gets burnt on the outside, but doesn't cook on the inside. He just assumes it's done. Right. I mean, and why not have, like, a fucking griddle? You know, like, you, you know, like a, a flat surface you could actually, like, cook one properly on? Um, I mean, because cooking, I mean, let's face it, cooking in some kind of pan can work, but it doesn't really come out all that great all the time. Um, Jesus Christ, man. I want to eat this last piece right here. What? Oh! God damn it. Fuck, That's what I come back dude. to. You like these yeah. crazy calzones? Subscribe for more. It's going off because of you cool cobras. With... No! A bit more of that. More cheese. More. You know, on it. Well, another dough. What the Give me some dough, folks. And he's not, like, you. why? You he didn't even put, like, any cooking? butter on the top, oh, like, no, spread no, no. it. In. Ooh, that butter. What in, Ew. what in the unholiest. That's why he didn't put butter on it, because he was putting I the grease on it. Because he was putting the dirty-ass greasy butter on it. What in the unholiest of fucks, dude? Oh, man, I am fucking exhausted. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh. No, I'm finally done. I got all 24 jars done. I got a bunch more down here. I still got to do it. I'm just going to pour this. that buttery goodness. Did you steal them? Take a look at yes, this. Yes, they're sealed up. They're just killing, waiting for the, uh, waiting to go in the fridge. My delicious consumption. <sighs> oh, my God. Dude, how the look fuck? Look at that pool that was of grease. disgusting. How the fuck that did not catch fire in his oven? I mean, has it gone in yet? No. Like I'm just saying, because if you if you look right here, you ha literally have a pool of grease that's running over here. When he puts this in the oven, how it did not actually catch fire is what my question is, because this right here is just a fucking fire hazard waiting to happen. Jello says your pause game's on on point. <laughs> this is fucking... Please don't pause it here. <laughs> Go ahead and put it in the oven. For not long enough. We For got a calzone in the oven. That's the magic of the cooking video. I don't edit. People are going to be like, is there really any point to all this? Making an hour long video just to cook something? Like, yeah, well, if you got the time to, if you got like a good two hours before you got to do anything or less, this would be a great way to start your day. And no, not really. No, it's not. It's not this, at this all. Is like, Don't do it. This is like watching Rev try to do a mukbang. Ugh. And I still wish that I knew someone who could find me a copy of that first one because I would love to, to play it for those who have not seen it. It's the Bonefish uh, Grill one, wrong. right? Yes, the Bonefish Grill. He got that wrong. Hold this on. isn't a good way to start your day. Really, this is a good way to start your diet. things like pizza were discovered? If you really think about it. And they just they threw it together. They're like, uh, I don't know how the fuck this is going to turn out, but let's just do this, 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 and this, and this, and this, 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 this. Boom. Like, Code's remix. The first pizza was born. <laughs> they served it to the Queen of Italy, and she was like, yo, this shit's bomb. Boom. What the fuck? That's how the pizza was born, baby. Oh. That's yeah. YouTube, if I could show you. I'm, 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 like. oh, I'm, wait, really, I... I'm really sure that pizza is that gangsta. <laughs> <laughs> Love in the pause game. <laughs> I'm I'm just trying to see what Jello is saying too. This is why I can't watch him live. It takes him hours to do nothing. Yeah. I'd rather look at shit. Like I said, guys, like I said, can you hear me? Yeah. Oh, okay. Like I said, this isn't how you start your day. This is how you start a diet. Exactly. 
I can. Ha ha. Look at it, YouTube. Just oh, see, look, look at, at that. It. It's Isn't it's that smoking beautiful? uncontrollably. One person commented, Cobes, do you secretly live in Flavor Town?" <laughs> Hey guys, I'm sorry, but I, I gotta bounce. Oh, fucking hell. All right, brother. Well, thank you for coming and hanging out with us, man. Uh, hit me up later. Let's play some magic. Close up. Later, I appreciate honey. it, brother. Later, right. brother. Good to see you, everybody. Him asking if he lives in Flavortown uh, is an yeah, insult yeah, to my Guy Fieri flag that's hanging up right I'm now. You yeah. right. tell him. You tell him, man, dude. So get over it. Trying it. This video's long enough. You might have to see me try it on another video. <laughs> a lot of pickles. Cliffhanger. Joe, if you want to hop in here now, you are mo you're more than welcome. Check out okay. This yeah, yeah, yeah. No, that's not a cliffhanger. cliffhanger. He just never ate it. Okay. <clears throat> yeah. Hang on. Let me go back to the channel and I'll pull it back up. Oh, Jello, friendly reminder that Shani said she wants to lactate sour cream. Yep. Cool. Never forget. Folks, never forget. If I have to live with it, so do y'all. Yeah, I hate you. <laughs> <laughs> no, you don't. We Mango is a peach. She she can just be very cruel. This is very true. Mm. Okay, we'll let's we'll check out the honey mustard ribs. What's up, you two? All right, it's your boy King Cobra. We chilling like rock star villains. So it is Christmas. I'm going to make some ribs. Again, but this time it's going to be a, a, a honey mustard base ribs. He looks like he looks like a roadie that just never could actually do the job properly, but they just keep him around to laugh at him. <laughs> My ears was burning. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, brother Jello? <laughs> What's up? <clears throat> uh, you know, I got to apologize to uh, Mr. Lizard here. Uh oh. Um, uh oh. I've been very unfair. I, I, I saw his perfect teeth and I was jealous and I, you know, uh, got angry. Um, now seeing his piece of shit hairline, he's much <laughs> more humanized. And I kind of feel bad for giving him so much shit. <laughs> so I apologize, sir. That's, uh, I imagine that's just because to I said To both you and your 60-year-old hairline. <laughs> You're you're only telling me this because I said I've never seen you before, so I imagine you have that nice voice, but you're. I don't really... believe it's the truth. Everybody's I, seen me. I no no no. no. I'm, I'm a mess. I have yeah, an absolute mess. <laughs> you uh, you probably look like Ricky Berwick after a fire. You just you're just like on a hospital bed with all these tubes. I look like one um... strangled little finger able to click back and forth to come in. I, I, I look like more of that... patriarchy, except for less fat of a face. And I gave up on the shitty hairline a long time ago, so I shaved my shit. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I, me know, too. I, I see, I see a dying duck, and I put it out of its misery. My hair don't quack no more. <laughs> All right, you can you can lay off me a little bit. Yeah, I should. I that's that's what I came in here to say. I I I'm I feel terrible okay. now. I didn't realize. It's Thank like you. we don't don't worry about the teeth anymore. Let's just uh let's just make sure make fun of the the hairline. Like the stream, bros, please. Yeah, like <clears throat> like the stream for you know. Like the stream hairlines. for lizard's hairline. <laughs> Oh, it's not, it's you know what it's, now it's I, like um now it's I like wanna making wear a girl all through <laughs> dinner, you know, and just like you know, she's a really hottie, so you just kind of nag on her a bit, right? And then you and then when she scoots away from the table, she's like she's got one leg, and you're like, fuck, fuck, I oh shit. Oh jello Jell canceled. God damn jello, it. jello is far too ableist for my likes. I'm sorry. <laughs> He won't even he won't even date a woman with without. You know, no, that's two not legs. true. I totally true. would. I would just feel bad of, after having made fun of her for so long. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> terrible. You can't do that. That's not right. Jello Jello kind of has a conscience. <laughs> yeah, yeah, once he, he just finds kicks out, in way too late. <laughs> once, he, you know, once he finds out there's something wrong with you, he's like, "Oh man, I didn't mean to be a shit bag. Let me just point out all your flaws." Right, my, my 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 conscience doesn't really work like, hey, don't do that. It's more like a, hey, you shouldn't have done that. 
that's <laughs> all right. That's fair enough. All right, let's let's see what this monstrosity looks like. Okay, just look at all these ingredients. So mm. let's uh, let's get the ribs open, and we'll get into it. Got the oven preheated. Get the ribs, ribs open. Bro. Well, at least he needs to preheat the oven. Blood or what have you? Just kind of drain it off into the sink. I like got this brand of ribs that I got last time. On so I, got I really need to shave. I got a Wait. big bushy beard going on, so he's actually, <laughs> he, as far as as far as the beard goes, he's totally killing it. You know, comparatively to me. I mean, do you do you have a better yeah. ponytail? I shave my head. Like I don't, I don't <laughs> yeah, but like, I imagine I got way too many holes in my hairline to even <laughs> pretend like long hair is. Like, I feel like if I'm still have a rat long tail, hair again, though. it's a wig. It's gonna be a wig. I guarantee. <laughs> Jello would get a wig with a man bun. One of his hot dog rolls has a, just a rat tail coming off of it. He's holding on just in case it grows back across across the plains. <laughs> I'm gonna ask Miss Parker when she retires that green wig if she'll send it to me. <laughs> <laughs> then we'll start seeing Jello on camera in a green wig. Fuck yeah, it'll be Jello and Mangu, the you know the green hair twins. There twins you go. <laughs> We're gonna take a fork and we're gonna stab our ribs. Oh, just oh, like that, fork it. tenderize it. <laughs> fork. Fork it good, boy. Pretty much just like our last, well, last rib recipe, just kind of. Dee -dee -dee -dee. Only hey, we're doing a, a different sauce. Wait, what was what was that noise he just made? It's probably a grunt. Is uh, <clears throat> you know. Recipe just kind of. Dee -dee -dee -dee. <laughs> Only we're doing a, a different sauce. Now, before we add our base sauce, I want to take our our seasoning. And we're gonna have our country crop. And we're gonna plop what some the, of that butter. What? what the hell? Wait, what did he get? He's putting butter in. Wait, hang on. That's not even butter. That's corn, uh, canola oil. The crop. And we're gonna plop some of that butter. It's country crop. Stop. That, that's Morris code for I can't cook. Yeah. It <laughs> give us a nice is. greasy base. That's for sure. <laughs> you rub. This will eat a hole in your stomach. Some liquid smoke. And then we're gonna add a splash of soy sauce. That's what oh See god. This leftover honey mustard that I have from uh craves. We're gonna add that to the to the mix. I bet you that three pounds of this. cheese he adds to everything is the only thing that keeps his stool firm. <laughs> Everything is just, it's just oil and corn. <laughs> I said that as classy as I could. Think about it. That could have been way worse. Right. His his poor toilet. <laughs> could you imagine? It's, it's okay. Think now, about think about it like this. Cobes can could, probably could not replace his own toilet. So when that thing goes out, that poor plumber or Clint. <laughs> that no, poor guy. That, no, that toilet is going to sprout legs and just fucking walk the fuck out. Be like, I can't deal with this anymore. <laughs> <laughs> I watch a lot of um, videos of people eating like crazy hot peppers and uh, pepper sauces and things. And, you know, there's always that running joke about, you know, the aftermath, the next day. They call it ring of fire, yeah. you know. But, you know, there's something in your mind that goes, wow, I wonder how bad it really was. It's, like, it's not just, you know, you're shitting fire, right? You got stomach cramps that go with it. Yeah. You're hanging on to the counter yeah. in the bathroom for dear life while you're trying to. <laughs> Yeah, it's uh, uh I, I did the one chip challenge and that shit fucking killed me. Well, like, then you know bad. about the stomach cramps. Yeah, it was horrible. It was horrifying. Hey, I never wanted trying to, to trying to shit with stomach cramps is weird because you know it's all it's it's muscles, both what you're trying to do and 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 they're 
both involuntary muscles, right? Now, I do have <laughs> I do have a question for Lizard. After you did the one chip challenge, did you immediately drink your bong water? No, <laughs> <laughs> I didn't happen to have any on hand. Too bad Nurse Danny wasn't there to tell you how to do it. <laughs> Here, they're giving you five bucks. Drink the bong water. <laughs> Honestly, he did nothing for money that I wouldn't do for money, but mm, it wouldn't be five dollars. Oh no! Oh no! You'd have, to, you'd have to give me at least a hundred bucks to drink like bong water that dirty. Well, see, that's the thing. Like, if your bong is really dirty from heavy use, eh. You know, that's one, but yeah. if it's, if your bong water has been sitting around for a while and it's dirty because you just don't clean it, that's, I mean, you know, stagnant water. Like if you're, if your bong water is the consistency of maple syrup, it's time to clean your goddamn bong. Well, it's just, I'm just yeah. like, like it collects dust. You know, and then you're uh, drinking like, uh, yeah, yeah. That's what I'm saying. Like, like I'm saying, if 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 it's if you like, if you change the water every other day or whatever, and it's just a lot of maybe you had a party last night and the bong was used all night and it's got a lot of chunks in it. It yeah, that's gross and it's gonna be hard to swallow. Uh, but it's not nearly as nasty as like a bong that doesn't get cleaned. Exactly. And I think Shani and Rev probably don't change their water in their bong very often. Oh, fuck no. Ever. Oh, Lord. <laughs> uh, Mango, did you have any luck finding the video I was asking about? Is the Bonefish Girl one where he, the one where he starts like choking on salmon? Uh, no, that was something else. Okay. The, the Bonefish bone Girl, was, girl in... was done in the bedroom. Yeah. Ew. If Why? That helped. Because some of them were done at the dining room table, but let's let's not forget the, the infamous uh, vegetable surprise cooked on the bed. Food cooked porn individual. <laughs> that little piece. Well, of since porn. I know it took place in the bedroom, that's going to make it a little bit easier. I did find one of his uh, from a restaurant called Black Eyed Peas that was done in the uh, bedroom. Yeah. Ooh. It's terrible. Well, oh yeah, all his mukbangs were terrible. This just mixture. terrible like this. Whoop, look at that. No. Beautiful. Uh, no See that mixture? Mm-hmm. Mm. Now we're gonna add a the fuck was that? of our habanero honey. Yes. That was apparently that was the, the honey mustard sauce. The splash what? of our habanero no, 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 honey. No, I mean what's in the bowl? Beautiful. Oh, oh what's mixture? in the <laughs> bowl? <laughs> the other like, day Eddie said to me, What's in the box? I said, say it right. She's like, what? She, what's, what's the bowl? The box? Box? Like, oh. say it right. She says, what do you mean? I said, oh, what's in the box? <laughs> That's the only way you can ask what's in a box. You have to what's cry about box? it. Like, yeah. What's in the box? I, I, I this. Yeah, I don't what know. the fuck is that? I, it's apparent. Okay, it's supposed to be it honey like mustard. There's chunks of apple pie filling in there. Oh. Wait, chunks of apple pie filling and honey mustard? Oh. That's what it looks like. <laughs> it looks, uh, it looks, no, this, that's not okay. No. It looks, is that. You know what I'm going to hope it is? Cream I'm going to hope that's like a, um, like a, like a, um, like a cake batter, like a batter or a dough. And then the chunks of, like maybe he's making an apple crisp. That, no, he's making ribs. He's making oh, ribs. Fuck. Bro. <laughs> I'm so just, this is this is sauce right here. He's making ribs. Like there's honey mustard, liquid smoke, uh, soy sauce for some goddamn reason. Um, and now here in just a second. Mm -hmm. Now we're gonna add a splash of our habanero honey mustard. And we're gonna microwave it. Get all that butter melted. Mm. Okay, I'm gonna put a couple of tiny wait, what, scoops in there. What, wait, what was that? Couple of tiny what? scoops in there. Not a whole. Okay, I'm gonna put a little. Well, I'm guessing preserves. Okay, I'm gonna put. A Fuck. It says berry. Yeah. A couple of tiny scoops in there. Not a whole lot. Just a little bit. Let's see when it pulls out. What it. What, what, oh, fucker. Yeah, I I think it's I think it's a jelly. And now we're gonna add 
Just a little bit of Bud Light Platinum. Oh, oh sure. Why not? Mix, so we, we'll give oh, it. fuck you. Honestly, oh, beer is, is the first thing I agree with him putting in it. <laughs> putting putting shitty beer in shitty food. No, no, I just, I just mean putting beer on your ribs. That's the first thing I, that I don't think I would have put any of the rest of that. Mm -mm. Oh wait, did he put liquid smoke in there? A little bit of liquid yes. smoke's okay. Right. I mean, but liquid smoke, like I've never used a lot of it, but no, two, three drops. Exactly. <laughs> but it's still like there was no need for the soy sauce. No, none. No, that just makes it salty. Very nice beer taste. Cheers to the holidays. Mind. And Merry Christmas. And happy the beer's got to cut back on the fucking fans, salt. Family, okay, I'm family, actually going to let this play for a minute friends. because speaking of beer, yeah. I'm going to go get another Sam Adams. So I'm going for a splash of beer in there. And not quite. There we go. It's like right to here. Do one more little squizzle. There we go. I got the stove heated to 420. Yeah. Frosty Bunda. Has he For ever made base, anything There's our honey mustard beer, beer. Gross. Butter. Oh my goodness! I gotta try a sip. Let's just try a little little taste of our our base here. No, don't do it. Let's not. Yeah. Right. Oh, YouTube, sweet oh, is right. YouTube, can I show you something else too? <laughs> yes, one second. Shh. No, look at it, look at it. I got a okay, I'm Brent. Back. I got a barbecue lighter for Christmas and among other things. But check that out, new computer baby. Okay, did I did I miss the spreading of this nasty sauce? Not no, yet. no, no, he hasn't oh. spread it yet. Okay, sweet. <laughs> Now we're going to take there you go. our sauce. Oh, God. And we're going to just, you know, let's, be, let's speed things up a bit. Do, 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 do. Oh. Just like last time, we'll just dump oh, it on there. Oh, my God. Dude, it fucking, it looks like vomit. Yeah. Yeah, it does. Yeah. It, it honestly just looks like just straight up fucking vomit. And it's too fucking... And it's too thin. It's too thin. Like, um, Mango, give, give, give us your culinary expertise on the art of saucing ribs, please. When you sauce ribs, like, you want to make sure that everything is very even. You want your sauce to be thick because it thins out as it cooks. Go fucking figure. And while it cooks, you want to make sure to baste it with that sauce so it absolutely get soaked in there correct can we just throw cobes out <laughs> we cancel cobes no not, not even cancel them just throw the whole thing away <laughs> just no cobes just, just stop son you know <laughs> Can't stop. The only reason I'm not with my fan no uh, could you imagine if you had crazy Lokes and cobes on the same stream no, not particularly. I think the universe would like it. crack if if that happened. Family right now on Christmas is because I'm making wands for Etsy, baby. Woo. Yeah, buddy. Oh, shit, no. Time is money, YouTube. Time is money. Here we have it. It's our honey I mustard tried based four, ribs. Four separate occasions to buy one of his wands. He only makes like three at a time, and they sell out fast. Believe How much does he charge for them? Uh, it depends on what you're looking for. He also makes stabs, so you can get a wand from him anywhere between like 30 and 120, I think. Good Lord. Jesus. Well, they're all handmade. Well, right. They're all 100% <laughs> unique. Kind of like these ribs. Now I'm going to open up the stove. That's an oven, you dick. Kind of watch it like a hawk. Sit it in between the top and the bottom one, right in the middle rack. There she be. Ribs. 
I told y'all, just throw the whole thing away. Now let's see if he. Let, let, wait a minute! No, no, if wait, wait, can, wait, wait! I, I, have, grab, oh, sorry. I, I have to run that back just a bit. I want to, I want to see that again. Ribs. <laughs> Ribs. I, I am curious to see if you can grab a bone and give it a shake and see if the meat falls off. I, I would, I would like to see if he's. You know, of course, of course, he didn't. You know, um, prepare them properly. But let's see if he cooked them properly. Hashtag, them a, hashtag them ribs. Ribs. <laughs> Should we do it one more time? One more time. Who is the puppy? Who's got the puppy? Ribs. That's uh, that's King. Ribs. Poor, poor Papa. What is wrong with the puppy? Uh, he wants all the attention. He's not getting all the attention. Sweetheart, he needs attention. Give him attention. He and why does he have to make the whole pack of ribs for just him? Because he's gonna doing? eat that shit like in one like one day. No, he's not. You too. Here are those ribs, ribs. fresh out of the oven with a little bit of caramelization. No, there isn't. Mm. Those are our honey mustard beer ribs, part two. Oh, don't those look dank? No. I drank the rest of that beer. From of the, course you did. I made it. That's all right. Like that. Let's see how they do. Crack open the Mountain Dew because we're out of beer. Like that shit. Sorry about the whining, whimpering dog. Puppy dog. He's a I thought it was dog. somebody laughing. I couldn't tell the difference, to be honest with no, you. No, that was my damn dog whining and crying because I wouldn't let him near my ma. <laughs> <laughs> He's tearing at that rib like it's a cheap steak. <laughs> That's He's because good. it's freaking chewy as shit and disgusting. Yeah, yeah, that was my point. I can't. It's. Mm. I just can't. They're dripping with grease. Buttery honey, honey mustard love. These are scrumptious. Buttery honey yeah. mustard love. They're not scrumptious. You oh, oh, <laughs> oh my god. Uh, should we do one more and then maybe play a game? I'm trying. I've been trying to yeah. find a pizza to order. <laughs> Fucking hungry, but I don't know. Coach, did you not get sick hungry. of pizza after the uh, the Domino's? No, I've I haven't had pizza in so long that <laughs> I don't know what. To <laughs> okay, do. all right. What what does what does the lizard man like on his pizza? Oh, I'll get everything. Put everything. I love me some anchovies on my pizza. Put me put some of that. Surprisingly, on I have never had an anchovy pizza. Me either. That's, that's so what good. I told him. Like anchovy is so a fur bearing fish. Uh, they're so salty that when you get them on your tongue, they actually feel like they're fuzzy. Yeah. yeah. Uh, to me, nothing that salty belongs on a pizza. I don't have a problem with it. I love me a um, a Caesar salad. Oh yeah, oh, my fucking God. love it. Like anyone that wants to tell me anchovies are gross, I'm gonna be like, well, you don't fork them out of a goddamn can. Like that's that's <laughs> no. <laughs> that's that's no. bad for your heart health. <clears throat> yeah, they're sp use them sparingly. Uh -huh. To answer to answer Super Ghost's question, uh, we do this for the bras. That's why we do it. Bruh, bruh, Can I get a bra? Can I get a bra? Bra. Where did Slim go? I don't know. Did we scare him off? I think Cobes cooking might have made him run to the bathroom and go vomit. <laughs> I've never had salmon on a pizza, so I wouldn't know. There's a place near my house that does a, it it's a, it they do a cream sauce, and then uh, like locks, like lightly smoked salmon, and uh, capers. Ooh. Ooh. Do we want to do a burger or another calzone, or do we maybe want to? I'm curious about this fried avocados. I don't want to see him destroy another calzone. No. Do a burger. Okay. Um, what is 
curly. I gotta, fries. I gotta warn you if you haven't seen his burgers get pretty rough. Oh okay, yeah. There's like the last time here. I watched one of his burgers, you know that black horrible grease that for some reason widow decided to pause on on top of the calzone last time he made a burger Eat while lunch. he was holding the burger the grease was that same black grease was just running down his arm it was just flowing down his arm like like uh urine down an elderly person's leg it was um, just disgusting yeah i would i would like to make just a quick announcement here uh people we have just hit 250 subs today. Oh shit! Nice. Congratulations! Wonderful. Thank you. That's awesome. Thank you. Um, wow. <laughs> um, <laughs> that was quick. Um, not, but we've everyone's already roasted me. You'll have to wait. You'll have to wait for another chance before that comes up. Um, let's. I don't. This. There's no description for this one, so let's check this one out because it just says another burger. Hey everyone! What the fuck? Again. Oh, it's too nice. Cobra, JFC Cooking Channel. If you I haven't seen this dude here, for a minute. Is he still alive? Then I'm gonna eat. I don't even know who this is. Either way, enjoy. He um, he's a lull cow. He used to do these uh videos where he would open a brand new bottle way. of like Stick Jack Daniels. I don't and like then just either. chug it yeah, on yeah. camera. He would he was he would do chug videos. Only he did it with like like fifths of alcohol. Of Christ. course, who does he think he is, Lemmy? Well, I mean that he always he uh, always he cheated. He would empty out his bottles and then you know refill them. No. Uh, so he'd be chugging you know water with food coloring in it or oh, like. Right. Um, or just water. All right, let's see what this what monstrosity is, up, is. Fellow YouTubers, it's your sexy goth bad boy, King Cobra JFS. Back at you with another cooking video. And today, we're going to be making a uh, bacon mac and cheese burger. Oh, say, really? What? Bacon mac and cheese well, burger. Well, you might have to stick around because... um. We're making some dankness. Bun isn't We're enough make carbs some dank for some food people. For your sick <laughs> entertainment. And if you think this burger looks good, then give it a try. If, however, you're sick and tired of the burger recipes, there's the back button. No one's stopping you. All right. <laughs> so I'm going to go turn the stove on. Take you along for the road here. Got some Let's grease see. in the bottom of our pan that'll do nicely for. Uh, for no, uh, you fuck. Oh, can somebody do, answer. You know, this is probably a stupid question, but what does JF stand for? Some... It's a, it's his name. It's like it, Josh something something. Josh Saunders. Oh, okay. Josh yeah. Saunders is his first and last name. I forget the F. Probably like Franklin or something like that. Yeah, I don't Franklin know. Franklin or Francis or. Yeah, you want it to be Francis, but it's probably not. I'd, I'd like, <laughs> I'd like it to be. Believe me, that's the first one that came to my mind when I thought of F names. I'm like, oh, he's got to be a Francis, but you know, my I'm never Just that lucky. Sucks. Just fucking sucks. <laughs> Very flavorful, deliciousness. I've already got some mac and cheese made out, so that's not going to be an issue. However, we're going to need box. some seasoning for And, and by the way, I'm not a big fan of meat. Dachshund or nothing. So, he gives out his right. name on a lot of his videos. That's yeah. why I, I'm quite comfortable saying his name. Yeah. <laughs> Use four different seasonings. We got Tony's. We got some okay, of... okay. My question is, unless you work in a kitchen, why do you have that much Tony Satchels? I mean... Um, I mean... I do buy the big containers, not that big, but the, the like next step down from those. Yeah, like the like the ha like the actual like like the, actual, like, like the actual like handheld shaker, like the tall ones or something. But not like you have to have, not it doesn't look like a jug is basically it. right. It, it depends on the seasoning mix. Some people find certain seasoning mix that they really like to put on everything. And I don't know. I don't really have a problem with it if that's your go-to thing. But I don't have a seasoning mix like that. <laughs> I just don't. I don't. 
Um, I've I've had Danos. I like Danos. I've had um, uh, Old Bay. I've had I've had a lot of different seasoning mixes, and they're they're good. They're good, but I couldn't imagine having anything that I just wanted on everything. I mean, I usually have a lot of saffron and uh, adobo in the house, but. <laughs> Okay, we're hearing the new demo of uh, Blizzard's One Man Band. Yes. I, well, Wait, no, you, you didn't have to mute. You didn't have to mute, dude. I was just fucking with you. <laughs> he doesn't want us to hear the new single before it's released. No, we can we can we can watch it being made though. That's what we can do. Absolutely. <laughs> now he's going to turn his camera off or turn his back so we can't see it. <laughs> now I'm curious. Is he, uh, <laughs> is he pulling out uh is, is he, he's either pulling out a uh, stock or he's skimming grease. It Does anybody know what he's making? Brine. He's making brine for pickles. Oh man. Okay. So he's not doing either of those. <laughs> <laughs> He's just oh, oh we got it. We're getting another sneak peek, folks. Hey, man, you, I I need you to put about uh, three tablespoons of red uh, flakes into mine. He's into already got the ghost peppers in it. Oh, ghost peppers! I right. no 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 no. I got Cal Carolina Reapers and twenty three oh, and twenty four of those jars I just put in there. So well, you gotta like. <laughs> I mean, are you trying to do a challenge or what? Like, no, the the. The pickles don't absorb a ton of the heat. What actually happens is uh, you'll eat them and get the pickle flavor and then like a lot of heat. And then the pickles, the, the vinegar just sort of washes it down. It's yeah, it will, really the mild. vinegar will uh, dissipate. Like, uh, that, the, the, the stuff that oh, makes yeah. those peppers hot is it's an oil. Yeah. The yeah, uh, vinegar tends to break up oil. That's, uh, you know, so many people like uh, go, go for the milk or the ice cream. But yeah, no, just that doesn't work. Coat over it, and it won't always help oh, very much. That's so welcome. I Good definitely, you. if you're gonna do a, a spicy challenge, have you a nice glass of lemon juice or vinegar next to you? See, I I use pickle juice for the one chip challenge and stuff, and no, it pickle still didn't work. Fun. That shit fucking got me still. <laughs> <laughs> All right. That slap your mama Cajun seasoning. We have some Payne County Rust meat seasoning. And we got some of that delicious Smoky D honey chipotle barbecue rub. Oh, Jesus so first fuck. First, grab ourselves a plate. I mean just put you some sriracha nays. Just put some sriracha nays on there too, Codes. You don't need everything on it. <laughs> No, but apparently he thinks that you do, uh, because it, uh, you know, flavor town and shit. No he offense, Mango. I'm not meaning to uh, offend your flag. <laughs> yes, I, you tell that to the guy at the area. Um, sorry. Oh, poor Mango. She looks. She was she's been her. angry. I think she's been angry at me for like the last half hour because I've been showing this. <laughs> well, no, you didn't show the dank nachos or the beer eggs or the. I wasn't going to do that. To you. I wasn't. I wasn't going to do that to you. I wasn't going to do that to you. Okay. <laughs> Jello. I ate two beer eggs. They weren't that bad. What the fuck is a beer egg? It's an egg that's hard boiled in beer. What you do is you mix Bud Light and water and you boil it all the way down and then you add more Bud Light and then you boil it down again until the shells crack. And you can do the same thing with Mountain Dew, only don't. Actually no, do no, it. It's don't. a lot better. You should definitely try it. Try them out. It's got a nice tang to it. Yeah. Especially in that end bite. I don't like cooked <laughs> yeah. eggs in the first place. That that Just the way you're talking about cooking them. Sounds terrible, and like I'm not even <laughs> thinking about the the taste of They're, what the beer that's, that's or the how, That's how Cubs cooked them, and we had to because charity. Okay, okay, no, I get it. I get what you say, say. No more. I get it. Um, 
I would not make food the way he makes it and then eat it. But if that was the plan, then you do that shit. You stick to it. And uh, Yeah, we made the promise and we did the thing. And I can never drink Mountain Dew or eat Doritos again. I mean, I could do both of those, but I'm, I'm not going to. I'm not potted meat. I mean, I don't Widows. want to chip my own horn or yes. nothing, but try I eating this while watching Rev and Shannon got on bit on the back of my leg. Hang, 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 hang on, everybody. Yes, Mango? I might have a lead on that bonefish grill mukbang. Really? Uh, I know people. Damn it. Oh, I, I know, I know that you do. It, but... And I agree. I agree when I hear Miss Parker say that everybody needs a mango. Um, They're checking uh, for me. Oh, if, if 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 this if this comes to light because Lizard has never seen this, I cannot wait for his reaction oh, to it. I can't. I hope I want to see this. Please. Okay, now now I want to remind you that this is the one that I was talking about where he was using the the Magic the Gathering play mat as a placemat on his fucking TV tray. Oh, I think I remember yeah. this. And I honestly wanted to jump through the screen and just throw the food in his face i feel like i feel like i've seen this one but i haven't i haven't like reacted to it it's on someone else's stream probably like drag or something like that i know the no the geek uh, room the geek room did do it because i was on the i was on the episode of the devil's lettuce when they first showed it because i made the remark that when he starts it out because he's going like yay and all this other kind of shit that he sounded like special ed from crank yankers uh, oh. <laughs> I'm eating food, yay! <laughs> Which is pretty much what he's saying now that he's in jail. He used to eat food all the time. Like, oh yeah. Now he doesn't get to so often. No. <laughs> Although oh, now he has less than three better. days until his now, next court appearance. Oh shit, dog! Oh. I really want to. Ah, uh, he's gonna go back to starving. I see that's the thing oh, though. God. And he won't let him into his own mom's house. And that's hilarious. I really want to get a, a, a GoFundMe going to get him out of jail just so he's on the street. I don't think Rev <laughs> deserves the three hots and a cot that he's getting. <laughs> I totally agree. He's been a leech on the system for far too long. Right. What do you guys get, think? Get him thrown the fuck out of that fucking place. Uh, Honestly, though, if he wants to go back, he can just ask Gary. I mean, the house is in his name. This is true. Yeah, that is if, true. If Shani has Gary believing that he kicked the kid, I don't think Gary's going to let him back in. I don't think Gary knows what to believe. <laughs> Good. Yeah, that that's true too. All right, all right. Let's let's see what other nastiness Cobes can come up with. Mm, that we can assemble the burger onto. I want to pour a little Ow. bit of Tony's into the lid. What? A little bit of that slap your mama Cajun seasoning. Go ahead and stir that around. I'm not sponsored by any of the people that I use. Thank God. In or of. Whoa. Dude. All right, so we got all oh the my right God. In the lid here. Okay, now let's let's take stock here. Now, all of this seasoning has to have an extreme amount of sodium in it. Yeah, that's that's what I'm thinking. There's salt in everything. Look, all of these things are going to have garlic powder, onion powder, salt. Like all of those things are going to have those. Like everything. Right. It's just too Ow. much. It's just there's no hence the reason you don't use adobo and sasson together. They both have an extreme amount of salt in them. And okay, now who who we're real quick? Who wants to take a bet? We're gonna see either some liquid smoke, some soy sauce, maybe some Dales. Oh God! Uh, I, I'm I betting Dales to... because he's addicted to sodium. I'm, yeah. I'm waiting for the Doritos. That's, yeah. that's all I'm here for is the Doritos. And, well, and let's not forget the beef jerky. The Doritos make it all dank. Now, if you want to see him cook, people right, cook so that... with uh, uh, beef jerky. You got to watch prison spread videos. <laughs> they put I'm slim gems in everything. It's amazing. Our burger. We got some Texas toast. Here's our Texas yeah, because fuck nice hamburger stuff. buns. I would recommend using a spatula though. Excuse. I'm just um. Thanks for the hot tip. I would recommend using here, a right? shovel and throwing it the fuck outside. <laughs> all that, all that grease from our last 
couple of endeavors has cooked into <laughs> the bottom of these buns. All right, so now we need a beef patty. That hasn't been thawed. Fuck! Dude, look at this oh, shit. Gross. I mean... <sighs> bruh. How much of that is burger bits, and how much of it is, like, burnt bugs that fell in that shit? <laughs> Do you, I mean, honestly, do you think he just leaves the grease in that in that cast iron and just leaves it sitting on the stove? No, I don't think that. I know that. He is talking <laughs> about it. He never washes his pan. He just keeps building up his grease stockpile. Fucking disgusting. Oh, Christ. Great value. Right. And it's been no. found. And you, you don't need a whole lot of oh, Say again. Sweet. It's she been found. found. It. <gasps> yes. Oh. I was told to just give them a minute to upload and they'll send me the link. But yeah, uh, I got it. Uh, oh, friends, folks, and bros, we are going to jump back into the Rev time machine today. Oh, man. Um, I was about to go get a burger. <laughs> I mean, I'm like, <laughs> okay, I everyone, don't recommend eating while watching Rev eat. Yeah. I, I am fucking starving dude all i've had is like pizza rolls and well, some leftover Maybe salami you have it done before this is over. i thought you uh, were ordering pizza i was trying to but it's like i don't want to spend like 30 fucking dollars on shit there's no good deals yeah fuck it well, well where are you trying to order from is the question uh Domino's and uh one other place are the only place that deliver out here like i don't get deliveries for shit on anything DoorDash yeah. doesn't doesn't deliver out here. None, none of that shit. Pizza Hut so, has a really neat yeah, I'm, thing right I'm now sure. called the Edge. The yeah. Edge. Yeah, they, that... there's no crust that goes all the way all the way around it. It's the the toppings go all the way to the edge. That sounds like a sounds like a flatbread with extra stuff. It's a it's a it's a um, it's a thin crust. Yeah, yeah. I, I saw I saw a commercial for it. I was about and to it's say in the yeah. private chat. I wouldn't know. Oh, we don't have shit. a okay. All right, all right. Fuck, fuck you, Cobes. Fuck you, Cobes. I, <laughs> I saw review bra eat one. I was like, I got get me one of those. What I wouldn't know. We don't have Pizza Hut here anymore, and it depresses me. But you can still watch review bra. Yeah, duh. Oh Why would I my god, myself? it does in fact exist. You gotta watch review bra. Does anyone else here watch review bra? Yeah, I've seen them. Nice. You're welcome, Widow. Thank you, Mango. I appreciate that. Okay, now, before I share the screen, I just want to prepare those who have not seen this. So is everyone ready to go strapped in? Yes. Uh, I, you know what? I've seen candy, it a lot of times, so me. I'm going to mute. i got to put together a Keurig, so go ahead and start it without me. Um, no problem. Can I just say that my favorite mukbang of theirs isn't just a mukbang. You need the full experience. It's like um, <clears throat> it's like uh, it, you can't just listen to the wall. You got to have mother with it, right? Right. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, there's this one mukbang he does where Shani's cooking for him, and then he's eating at the. She's cooking in the kitchen for him. And then I forget what it was that he was, he was like some sort of casserole or lasagna thing or whatever. Oh but but she's cooking for him. And then he and then the, the next video is him doing the mukbang. And he starts it out with he's basically doing an ad for Pepto Bismol. He's holding yeah. the Pepto Bismol and it's like and he's cooking. Okay, I uh, real than the food. It's just real so quick. perfect. I do want to thank the, uh, oh, this was Miss Toast. Yep. Okay. Well, thank you, Miss Toast. She is a, she has been on the show a couple of times and she is a dear lady and a pleasure to speak to. And I'm certainly going to try to have her back on as soon as possible. But Miss Toast, if you are listening or watching right now, thank you so much for making this happen. Uh, this is, Sometimes this is a treat. All you got to do is ask. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> that is awesome. And uh, if you don't, folks, uh, uh, Miss Mango, if you could, can you post a link to Miss Toast's channel for the for the people, please? Um, go and subscribe to Miss Burnt Toast. She she puts out some oh, wonderful yeah. content. Yeah, she's pretty fucking dope. Oh, 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 she's awesome. All right, here we here we go. If you're not subbed to Burnt Toast and you're on this panel, get off. What? Do what? I said, if you're not subbed to Burnt Toast and you're on this panel right now, get off. 
Okay, let's let's take a moment to see to to um, this face here is like I I am this is gonna be one of my last meals ever. So <laughs> can we just appreciate how great the camera quality was? But yeah. How much it declined. True. Oh god. <laughs> all, right, yeah. all right. All right. Here we go. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's fucking special, Ed, dude. <laughs> I got bonefish grill. Yay. <laughs> Oh, I see the I see the mat. Now. Yes, right, right, fuck in there. Oh my god, uh, I want to leap through the fucking screen and just throw that food in his face. Oh my god. Hey, I never left home. I never left home. I'm in quarantine. COVID really blows, and it's making me agoraphobic. And let. Uh. Oh, I wish I could punch him in the fucking face. <laughs> like, dude, you you barely leave you barely left this house. You never really left the 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 uh condemned home that you were in, uh except to um get Delta Eight or give handies for Delta Eight or um blame a tire blowout on somebody with rebar or um God knows what else, but dude, uh, just... it only gets worse, folks. I Hi, I'm Jason Avocados, and uh, this is a mukbang channel. But um, I do not overeat mukbang. I'm not going to be an overeat channel and 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 gain weight. Like, okay, therein lies your problem. Because let's take a moment to look at Rev here. Versus what he looks like now, right? Oh man, you gotta put a few bars in front of his face. And well, <laughs> I'm, I'm, well I was talking about as far as weight goes because oh, that I mean, this dude right here was eating pretty well. Um, of course, this is when they were still, yeah. you know, what spending probably what like twelve hundred dollars a week on goddamn DoorDash instead of cooking Something food. like that. Fucking um, ridiculous, right? And I mean, look at, I mean, this is, dude. I mean, that's, Mike. keep going. I got to see this. Great friend, personal friend, Nick Acado Avocado. Yay. <laughs> <laughs> Guarantee he fucking hates you. <laughs> dude. And like to see, and that's, that's, that's the other thing is he claims to know this guy, but like, I can guarantee you that, uh, that, I have, I honestly know jack shit about this Nikocado avocado, except he likes to cry on stream and just like overeat religiously. Um, but he acts like they're best friends. Like, that's because everybody that they paid for a cameo, they consider their best friend. Well, yep. I mean, you know, I could get, you know, if I could and get a cameo from like, you know, fucking. Uh, Jack Black or something for you know the channel here. I'd be like, I don't know him. I just you know he yeah. This that's is how much you pay him, and he was kind enough to do it. Well, so, they all all they have is transactional relationships, so that's all they understand is like, right. oh yeah, we're friends, and it's just like, no, none of them, none of those people gave a fuck about you. They just got paid, and you paid them a bunch of money to say things. That's it. Yeah, I, I will yeah. say that they had allies. They had they had allies like it just um, yeah it, there were people that they paid specifically to like to, to to like you know say shitty things about people they didn't like and oh, I would call like those eggs? people their ally well you know whoever I'm not <laughs> yeah. pointing no fingers I'm just yeah saying we're we're, we're not pointing fingers we're just <laughs> we're just laying out facts there were people that did this and um. And as soon as that well ran dry and they weren't able to pay them anymore, those people turned on them like a right. motherfucker. Yeah. There was no loyalty uh -huh. whatsoever. And, you know, I'm, and I'm not, wouldn't even say anything bad about for this, you know, about the people that did, they got all the loyalty they deserved. You know? Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. That's all right. True. Let's, let's go. 
and you will see us doing a collab at some point in the future. And that was a total lie. Fucking yep. virus is gone. I like That's his lipstick I lesbian like look. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's oh, very he's... much a pillow princess. Oh yeah. <laughs> And this is when he had the uh, the highlighter head. Yeah. Yes. His, I'm, uh, yeah, his I'm hair sorry is... to hear you, Mango. That was a bite the what? <laughs> <laughs> his so hair matches his teeth one. still. I want, to do this. This is, I want this to mostly be a family-friendly channel where you can come with your kid and watch maybe some... some I would okay, never who in, subject a child to this. Jello, you fucking beat me to it. <laughs> I'm sorry, <laughs> I didn't mean to steal your thunder. My oh, dude. no, 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 it's cool. I was just about to say, why would you subject a child to this man? This is fucking horrible. This is true. <laughs> Unless, that's like saying you hate your child, basically. Yeah. I mean, yeah, you're better, Danny your did show up at his doorstep named with her Francis. <laughs> right. That's very true. She did. She yeah, barreled she her way into her his life. Into his life. Saying it's a kid channel. I'm just saying, like, I don't want to curse. Neck thing. You like his tablecloth. Oh, there's a big <laughs> neck thing. <laughs> <laughs> it's been so long since we've seen the neck thing. <laughs> You know, I, I, I hate to be this guy. I, I, I like to I, I like to be able to say I don't wish harm on nobody, but one of these days I want him to do the neck thing right into a whiplash. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Just just haul off like really wind up and just go too far and a couple of little snapping sounds and then he's got one of those fuzzy collars for the neck. <laughs> the oh my god. I have I'd to put him to in a halo. Connecting into a wood chipper in Minecraft. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm now, I wasn't, wait, look, I wasn't saying I want his neck broken or anything like that, but it would be funny if he did the neck thing so severely that he gave himself whiplash. Like, but that. now that he's in jail, now that he's like off nicotine, off any sort of like non-alcoholic beer, off of any other drugs, does he still do the neck thing? I mean, yeah. Well, I, I imagine probably. that's nerve damage. Yeah, so it guess. might be, but it also might be a fucking side effect of whatever he's taking because Shani did pump him full of Benadryl all the time. Well, people, uh, the people Drag interviewed said that knew him in high school said that they would ask, actually, tell him to do the neck thing. Oh no, <laughs> no, we should do Rev. the neck thing. Uh, hey, yeah. And he, uh, <laughs> Hey, hey, hey. Yeah, can you imagine that? Fucking so all of a sudden you he hear was young, uh, he didn't have friends, he just hung around with people. He was the he was the um oh that's kind yeah. of sad. If you go to Drake's <laughs> channel and you look at the I don't know, whatever Ghost of Jason's Past or whatever it's called. Ah, that's yeah. sad too. I can't do yeah. that either. It's well, they're just like yeah, like everybody else went to the went to the sock hop, and this dude went to go have dinner with his mom, and like whatever fucking sock hop. Dude. What <laughs> yeah. is this? The fucking fifties, bro? Right. I didn't know whatever what other term to use. My bad. Uh, dance. Your oh, well, well, no, because I mean, back in school, like in middle school and stuff, we had a theme that was the sock hop. Mm hmm. I have no idea what a sock hop is, but I like the word, and I'm gonna so keep using it. So here's my mug. It's, uh, it's you, it was called a sock hop because you did it in I'm the a... school gymnasium, and your uh, street shoes would damage the gym floor. So you what? had to take your uh -huh. shoes off and dance in your socks. Yeah. Those old that shoes sense. that the girls used to wear with the they were shiny and had the buckles on them. I remember that. Like was... basically like tap heels without the metal, you know? Right. Like, they well, just, yeah. Weren't they the called like saddle shoes or some shit? Weren't they uh, Mary Janes? Mary Jane. I, I honestly yeah. don't know. I, I you know Jane's. what? The only yeah. thing I remember, like from like Laverne and Shirley, the poodle skirts. Yeah. <laughs> right. So I love But right. see, we skirts. wore all that that day because that was the theme. We wore the poodle skirts and the Mary Janes, and it was a lot of fun. I love asking women if their dress has pockets because if it does, they get so excited. They're like, because yes, pockets. it does. I'm like, yeah. How big are they? Can you fit a? Can you fit your phone in there? They're like, yeah. Look at it. Uh, and then pockets on dresses stuff. are bigger than pockets on our jeans, and it's an issue. Yes. Very true. 
it's a I huge love issue. that name, by the way. Immature old bat. That's fucking good. I like that. Uh oh. Someone want to take care of that? Oh, it's that. I already did. Oh, oh. thank you. The Gorn. All right, let's watch this idiot try is, to eat. Is this like some <laughs> Highlander thing? There can be only one. <laughs> exactly. Is that is that really like he had to go because of the name? Well, it's it's probably just fucking Dark Ninja and shit. Yeah. yeah. That makes they're, they're me not... want to like change my name to Ghost of Widow's Son and <laughs> come in and do the same shit just to get kicked out. That's that. I don't know if you call that mukbang, but I, that's what my mukbang's gonna be. So I have bonefish Dog shit? Here, as you can see, like the iconic. It's very iconic. Honestly, I never heard of it until I saw this video. I, I know it's probably. I, I think I heard Wilson say it's more, uh, like it's more expensive than like Red Lobster or something like that. I have no idea. Does never any, even heard of it? It's like a. Excuse me. It's like a. It's a. It's like a bar and grill type okay. deal so mm -hmm. they're gonna like if you look at the food um the containers that they have they have the black containers with the uh opaque lids to make it look a little bit fancier when you go there your food's gonna be dressed up on a nice plate and everything like that if you're gonna get you know the the sliders with the the chips or the fries in the fucking uh little funnel thing that Just... type of that type of deal rather than going to red lobster and getting like a plate of lobster and everything in front of you right and just seeing this poor playmat go through this monster it, oh god it's pissing me off yep uh fish head it's not that's yeah, a yeah, really it's big a mouse holy, pad. Holy fish head. <laughs> no, you, I... no no that's a playmat for magic that's a mouse pad big enough for your mouse and your keyboard <laughs> you can on set your drinks it, on there. You got the fish. Oh, it's a roly poly fish head. And Somebody we, ban we Jello. Put that right there. I'd love to be. No, we will not ban Jello. He just said to put a drink on a freaking magic pad. I know that, well, but we 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 will not we will not ban Jello. Um, look, he he just made he forgot to specify. Next time he comes to the dungeon, he, he's being he, tortured. He, <laughs> he forgot to specify that it has to be a cold drink, and especially on a warm day. I meant to say spill. Okay. okay. Now you you're really you know your drink on that. Okay, bo both both of both of you are pushing the envelope. There. <laughs> be sponsored by by Bonefish no, Grill because their food is extremely up my alley. Because I I am what you call it's a extremely up their alley. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Nearly, wait a minute. I want to. He he, he he he's a what? Nearly. Yeah, I didn't hear an R at the beginning of that. I am word. what you call a lacto ovo piscatarian. Nearly. What the fuck? Oh, that means what? That, mean, that means he eats uh, chicken and milk or eggs and milk. Yeah, it's a. Uh, what milk, milk, eggs, and uh, like chicken and fish, but he won't eat beef, which we know is a lie because we've seen him eat bacon and burgers, and we've seen him eat whale. Uh, oh, uh, <laughs> oh, seen him play around in piss. Uh, <laughs> can he say, hey, squirt, come on, I was just following the chain of dominoes, no, I was just I following the chain of dominoes. <laughs> Uh, which is in kosher, but that's okay. I'm recording something. Um, this is amazing, right? Yeah, shut your trap, you woman. I'm recording too, something really nice. I'll break it for you. See, this is really or was that nice one of the kids? Bread. I don't and, uh, hang I on. Like let me run that. Camera. Yeah, see, this is if, really nice. If you use the J and L, oh, you I can go back 10 fish. seconds, back and forth. I like 10 shellfish, seconds. uh, which is in kosher. But that's okay. I'm recording I, something. I can't. Oh, that was that was definitely a kid. Yeah, that yeah. was one of the kids. Yeah. I like um, the bread. And, I'm and recording wait, something. Amazing, and, right? right. Let's see the uh, let's yeah. see it again. Which is in kosher. But that's okay. I'm recording something. It's uh, like what I a... like your. I think he said I like your fish. No, he said I like the bread. Is that what he said? Yeah. I'll tear it. Okay. Whatever. 
this is amazing, right? He's a fucking We got dickhead. bread here, too, which is really nice. I'll break it for you. See, this is really nice bread. Yeah. It's bread. The, the kid, kid loves it. Maybe you told him, shouldn't have told him to really shut the fuck good, up. Actually. Maybe they you should give him mobile, some of the bread. Uh, USB-powered O-ring lights for production value, and it's pretty good. Which is terrible. Uh, this is nice bread. It's crusty. One of my... Kind of like your I like your wife. I mean, girlfriend. <laughs> <right. laughs> Notice he's got the drink bread. in between his, uh, like in his crotch there, uh, under the little just stand. Butter. Just, not too much, just a little glob of butter. Why does this idiot you know, have to tear it into little logo. bitty chunks? Why don't you just tear off what you're going to eat Can and then I put the rest of the block of bread down, this. you moron? Right, but see, here's the thing. He just, look, we already know where the food is from, you dickbag. Yeah. I got to finger that... fuck everything. Do what? I got to yeah. finger fuck everything. <laughs> Like, I mean, look, I, <laughs> I, 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 my, my uncle did this, man. We had a box of donuts, and I op opened it up and offered it to him, and he picked up every single one and put it back in until he found the one he wanted. Like, why do you have to touch them all? Why? Why do you have to do that? Touch your face. <laughs> and I remember this one time. This has nothing to do with it, but I was, um, I was in high school, and when you're in high school, you don't have a whole lot of money, and I. Like at the time, I didn't have a job, so I was just doing like odd jobs around when I needed money. And I got a couple of baked uh, junior bacon cheeseburgers from Wendy's because they're a dollar each. And I brought them over to my buddy Sam's house, and I brought one out. And he's like, "Hey man, can I get a bite?" And I was just like, "You know what? Sure." And this motherfucker shoves half of the fucking sandwich into his mouth and bites down, and then like rips it out. And he gives me back like this little sliver of crescent moon of fucking burger. Oh my god! <laughs> That's who a needs... fun trick to do to people. <laughs> who, need, who needs enemies, right? <laughs> I mean, you can hardly never, blame him for that. He worked like that's something he practiced at doing. He he knew what the fuck he was doing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He is definitely. He, he did that a lot at home with the intent of asking people for a bite. He, he yeah. watched the he watched the cafeteria scene in Animal House with uh, John Belushi like way too many times, and he's like, "I can fucking do that too." So <laughs> Pluto's my hero, right? He's got that poster of Jim Belushi in that uh, uh, sweatshirt that says college on it, like above his bed. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> the, the one frame everybody, uh, most people only afraid. know. I'm calling right. Corporate. Can somebody fold my bag correctly for me? There no, we go. Just see, now you can see the fish head. Put it the That's fuck down. Iconic, like, Throw it away. Logo. Leave the, the fucking head. bag you know, alone. So, anyway, here we go. First bites like this is first. To bite. anyone that wants to do mukbangs on the YouTube, so, uh, one rule is to try to avoid crinkling paper over the mic. That's right. that's a yeah, big no thing. Shit. You want to. No. So when you get your food out of your bag, you want to do that as quickly as possible. But then get the fucking paper away from you. You don't keep playing with it. Oh, I well, I have this uh, aluminum can filled with beans that are you know dried beans. I was just gonna toss that back and forth like my microphone. Right, right, right. You know? I'm just gonna beat on my, <laughs> my. I'm just gonna beat my the side of my Yeti with a tambourine. Yeah, sure. <laughs> why, why the fuck not? Because like audio quality is that's a thing of the past. Folks. Yeah, fuck that shit. <laughs> You know, I don't over. I don't like to overeat. I just like. To I eat bet you do now. Bowl, and that's it. I hate you so much. I mm -hmm. love bread and olive oil. I do too. Oh yeah. Oh my god, it's so good. Especially uh, like that's some bougie bread, mm -hmm. like nice olive oil. Fuck you. It doesn't taste that good. It's oh, bread yeah, and olive oil. Good. Suck my shit, Rev. <laughs> <laughs> All it is is some oil. I'm oh, dude! And on, on, are you? I love that. Wait, wait, on, wait. let's just me. let's just savor that moment. Let's back are that up like a couple of seconds. Are on the bed. Me? Yeah, on the bed. It. No way. No way. I mean, Shani yeah. lays on that bed, so what's the difference? Yeah, they get a All lot of grease on that bed. Some oil. Oh. Fuck, I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, oh, I know. If I got just some oil with like herb herbage in it, you know. Dude, it's I get oil and probably a red I put it. them in the fucking hamper. He's just letting it sit no, it there. The stomach, oh, yeah. You know? Just leave it. Fuck it. Just go right down in on the mattress. He's oh, recording. Nice. He's recording. You don't have time to mess with oil on the bed. Oh. Remember food porn, individual. Oh. Oh. So. Okay. 
No. Don't do that. Swallow uh, oh, first. My phone's there. <laughs> like like your mom Shit. should have. I'm so sorry. I wanted to get the specific <laughs> names of what Charlie I Canadian, so exactly. I How did he expect that to go? I'm going to taste. <laughs> you know, that's the best way to do it is just taste what you got. And there's bacon. This, this is not acceptable. That's still bread. And I did not really know that there was bacon in this. Um, and there might Are be you... mussels too, but you know what? I take it seriously at this point. What is he really doing? Want to eat like Where that. is he putting it? He's taking. So I am going to take that little bit that's bacon off. out and like putting it on the side of the probably on the mat, probably on the magic mat. Sh shut up, Jello. <laughs> oh. Why are you just stop, leave like, the bacon I'm sure in? It's all this. throughout the dip, so it don't matter. His because he won't eat bacon. He's taking his press, but whatever. Seriously, and we've seen him, <laughs> and we've seen him eat fucking bacon and meat. I mean, Jesus, this guy doesn't know who he is. One day to Bro, the next, give no. this motherfucker a double bacon cheeseburger with extra bacon, and Pronto. just watch. Just watch. I guarantee you, he will cry. <laughs> Oh, His yeah. whole thing. Absolutely. It would. It would be like it would be Revy the house elf getting clothes, or in this case, food. His whole thing about like trying to find personalities and every and everything he looks at, that's um, like that's that's from growing up without a dad. Like the uh, the whole daddy issues thing, it's really sexy on girls. It's really pathetic <laughs> on dudes. Like there's, there's yeah. such a, what what. It's a no, joke. I'm just it's telling you. No, no, like, no, no, I don't think anyone is disagreeing with I'm you. like Alex Jones. I'm just reporting the news. Folks. Yeah. That's that's not how that works. <laughs> like the big... In the center there, I don't want it. Has, has anyone noticed me? the really massive shadow that's been moving over here on this green screen? Oh, just Shani eclipsing the room. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, <laughs> it makes me sick now. You understand what I mean? Wait, what did God, he say? That's such a luscious sauce. Okay, no, don't go back. Go the only light. reason the there's water. any Holy light shit, getting man. on him at yeah. all is because the gravitational field that surrounds Danny <laughs> actually bends the light towards him. It's <laughs> he's got he's got like three ring lights just to get uh, sufficient illumination. <laughs> Those aren't ring that lights. Energy. That's Shani's folds. You know what I mean? <laughs> it's just, Here we go. It's, it's a normal bulb on a regular mm. lamp. It's just bent into a ring. Mm. Good chips. Oh, so cheesy. They're chips. Ooh. Man, bet those kids would love some of that. This is their right? emperor dip. That's what it's called. I believe. Yeah, emperor. and you, you took all the emperor out of it. Oh my god! What does so it taste like? I'm is gonna guess there's like there's maybe some flavors. smoked salmon and probably some lobster chunks in there, maybe. Mmm, <laughs> that sounds good. <laughs> food. Yes, food. Mm. The thing you're mm. getting right now while you're in jail. Yeah, for once. The thing you will not get again food. once you're out of jail. Now this is their muscle dish. This is all appetizers. Back. Oh, that's where he is putting it. I ain't done any entree this time. All right, yeah. This yep. is Prince Edward. One thing I will never order uh, order out is seafood. I'm going. I'm going straight to the source. So if I'm going, to, yeah, getting yeah, seafood, definitely. I'm getting it at the restaurant. That shit is not sitting in somebody's car for any period of time. No, nope. I don't give a fuck. Especially mussels. That's one way. To, that's an easy way to get fucking parasites. Oh, okay. definitely. Might be a little over paranoid, but no, I'm good. Lobster, crab, anything like that. You need to go to the restaurant to get that shit. Yeah, like it's, I'm not it's, even a fan of mussels because like, mussels are stupid. There's nothing in there. Fuck you, mussels. I'm, <laughs> I'm actually like I wouldn't, I wouldn't, <clears throat> I wouldn't order sushi and have it and have someone deliver it to me. I would literally just go and get it myself. Oh no, I put my sushi in the sun. The but do you working? Yeah, just to give it that extra like tang. Do you uh do you put uh <laughs> what is that Japanese mayonnaise or whatever on it as well? Let it Wasabi? sit out in the sun for yeah. about an hour. No, the the uh spicy mayo, of course. Yeah, yeah. 
No, I make my own spicy mayo. I just take regular mayo and sit in the get sun. He gets some sriracha <laughs> mayo. <laughs> Mayo's in there like Muscle. shit in there, so. oh, God. And it's like Wait. in a uh, wine and garlic sauce. And you can see the chunks of garlic on the top of the mussels. They love doing this type of thing, see? Yeah, because they're supposed to open when they when they cook, you the dick. Mm. And I'm sorry, you're first to go, bro. You're first on the menu. Mm. I don't want to hear you slurping that. Okay, oh, bef before he starts, I know that was disgusting. Everybody, <laughs> hold your lunches down. Uh, what description is he going to give? The flavor. The, the the texture the 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 ingredients if I he also pulls out mouthfeel I am going to just like leave oh I think he's not even he's just gonna say that's so good and fucking move on he, he's just gonna go mm, 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 yes what I, I don't know I mean it's fucking rev I'm waiting for the neck thing again to be honest with you uh, <laughs> eat a eat a muscle and do the neck thing rev <laughs> yeah <laughs> Whatever he says, I bet you he's not going to finish chewing before he opens his mouth to say it. Oh, I'm sure he's not. All right. Hold the darn phone. <laughs> no, that I did not expect. Hold the darn phone. <laughs> I need that one. I get, I, ooh, I'm eligible to monetize now. I gotta Are you really? Thing. Yeah. Finally. Congratulations, brother. Congrats. Yeah, I got it. I gotta remember at some point so I can actually like apply I'll remind for you it. next week. Yeah, I'll do it at some point, whatever. <laughs> you can do it when you uh, turn in your PO box application. Yes, <laughs> I can do that. Hey, I'm fucking I'm I'm pissed okay. that I gotta read. Oh good, that. you're gonna have a PO box. That means <laughs> that means we can send lizard weird things in the mail. I thought I was gonna have a PO box by today, but I don't like I mean, I haven't gotten a why well, I, I thought it was like a one two day turnaround. Maybe I fuck. I think I fucked something up. So I'm gonna have to go back there. I'm not going on a Saturday. It can sometimes Whatever. take up to like two weeks. Yeah. Can it? Okay. I was well, I was we'll about to say it. now that now that you're gonna have a PO box, everyone send lizard weird things in the mail. Yeah, I'm gonna have I'm gonna <laughs> set some rules about the PO box. Like all of them. Okay, I really don't give a shit too much of a shit what you send what you send me but think of the postal workers because i'm only going to be checking <laughs> this thing every couple weeks i'm not going to be checking it every day so if you send me like uh, a fresh durian fruit or something like that and it gets there the day after i check it it's going to sit there for two weeks like they're not going to call me and be like yo this has to go it's i'm going to sit I'm, there <laughs> i'm going to i'm going to send you a bottle of johnny walker black label by all means, fucking send it. Huh? <laughs> Guys, did anybody yes. stop to think that all that fish smell is probably making the room smell better? No, oh, it definitely because is. you'd have the fish smell coming from the food, but the worst fish smell coming from the land whale next to him. Well, right now oh, she's stationary. <laughs> did I break mango? I think we. Did. I have words. I am being polite. So I'm taking a moment. <laughs> Mango, Which, hate, um, Mango now hates me. <laughs> um, what was the Cthulhu flick where all the people were turning into sea monsters? I have, I have no clue. No clue. <laughs> really? Because <laughs> uh, the big boss at the end of that one, that's what Shani reminds me of. It's it's, uh, I think it's pretty much what Metallica wrote the thing that should not be about. <laughs> oh, okay. If you give out your P.O. Box number, there are no rules. This is YouTube. Be ready. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Look, man. I'll, that I'll, is true. Look, I'm, I'm, like I said, I don't care about me. All right. I'll, I'll try and identify the glitter oh. bombs and stuff and open those outside. But... I'm, just think about the workers. Think about the postal workers. They don't want to be around some smelly stuff. They don't want to have to uh, deal with bullshit 
Like at so least give me a warning. Nobody send a pair of you know? Shani's underwear to the postal workers. They no, might that, die. That, that would not get past the fucking door. At least if I <laughs> no, would, like, look, oh, you get, look, there you. is limits to uh, the size of things that you ship. And go, <laughs> yeah. like, <laughs> you, yes, point. you can a ship point. a car, you but it doesn't. Car boxes, you know. Yeah, the, you can the, ship a car, but it doesn't hang out at the post office for a couple of weeks. You know yeah. what I mean? Like it, it that ha- that it works differently. You're not just sending shanny's underwear through the mail that ain't just, happening yeah just no. because just because it's shipping doesn't mean you have to require a ship for it to get here yeah all good right? point like, good point <laughs> let's not push the envelope folks <laughs> okay oh my god the amount of flavor wow he Ladies. sucked on that he sucked on that shell way too long uh, you you want to know a fun fact about muscle shells? What's that? They're easily razor sharp. Yes. Mm-hmm. Yep. So he could have sliced Flavor. the fuck out of his mouth. Yep. Absolutely. In this sauce, the Prince Edward mussels at Bonefish Grill. Dude. Oh, my God. It's empty. Oh, my God. This sauce is literally 10 star sauce is it it's got like scallions mm-hmm. with the garlic and fresh garlic cloves chopped up diced in a light cream sauce it's light it's not where they heavy. chopped or diced he doesn't know the difference like look it just coats your finger see oh it's it because it's your fingers because it's oily oh my god this is like a bougie uh french dish guys like this reminds me of a french (laughs) (laughs) poor lizard had a walk away now no oh we broke lizard right there right there hang on literally right behind me get a fucking napkin rev get a fucking napkin Jesus Christ. I can tell that Lizard has never seen this before. (laughs) Oh my God. Like I I I get a fuck anytime I eat on on camera, I have like a napkin there. I eat more properly on camera than I do when I'm eating on my own. Because I'll like I'll eat spaghetti out of this motherfucker. I don't give a shit. I live alone. (laughs) Who the fuck is else is eating the spaghetti? Me. That's it. (laughs) <laughs> you know, if I'm making spaghetti for two people, I'm making spaghetti for two people because you're, you know, leaving before breakfast. But like, <laughs> but, what the fuck? Time. What the <laughs> fuck? But look, but Jesus, at the same just time, throw that on out there. I'm always, I'm always going to have a, a napkin or something, something to wipe myself. My, he's got to touch everything. Like I, I, I'm. I've touched my mouse and my face and I totally forgot that I had handled all those peppers and then my mouse. Oh, so that was dumb, gosh. but like, I haven't, I, I haven't felt anything. Luckily. You're lucky you didn't whack yeah. your bag. <laughs> <laughs> there is nothing like the feeling of jerking <laughs> off after having touched hot peppers. It's oh, you know, a <laughs> terrible mistake. My, my mom used to get me a uh, crawfish from the, uh, uh, from the market she would give me a big bag oh. of crawfish when they were on sale and i would eat them and they're like super spiced and delicious well there was one time where i got some of the spice in my eye because i like wiped my eye and i was like oh shit i can't see so i like, went down to go wash it out or whatever and when i finished i was like man i gotta pee well, i went to go pee <laughs> and i still had all the spiciness on my hands yeah Ooh. yeah that was a fun night man let me tell you <laughs> Like sixteen jerking off is really hard. You ever well, mistake? Uh, <laughs> you ever mistake Vicks mentholatum for uh, petroleum jelly? Mm, no, nope. Okay, <laughs> yeah, yeah, me ah. either. <laughs> I bought the big thing of Vaseline. Ca- that's cash. Did we break made Slim? It distinguishable. <laughs> I don't know. Give me a minute. Okay. I gotta find my phone. All right. I feel <laughs> like the um, the stream was better when Slim was here and I wasn't. I, I just want to <laughs> throw that out there. I, I, I don't know how I feel about that. This is absolutely... You need to try one of them. 
it's a work of art. Re oh, oh, <laughs> it's like a, it's, it's like a bear. <laughs> Watch out over. for the arms. <laughs> oh my God. Like her hand, her hand is bigger than his. It's massive. Shinny. Is this the bear that G-Man was scared of? Could be. Probably. I don't know, dude. We this saw that creepy love video from uh, Shanny the G-Man. I mean, which one? Mm, true. I think the and first it's... one was the worst. I don't know. I think the oh, worst I'm telling you, the worst one is when they're doing the fried chicken and watermelon. She's oh, looking God. at him like a fucking puppy dog. Creeping like death mushrooms in Shanity. Mm. She oh, watches lurking beneath the sea. <laughs> okay. Uh-huh. Yeah. All of that stuff. That is... was Shanny's muscle. Almost like chicken. Oh, oh, oh we we we've got some we got I, sauce on I the bed, folks. <laughs> Guys, we hey, got uh, shrapnel. <laughs> hey y'all, I hate to be a fooper party, Shanny. but uh I got a thing I gotta do. All right, brother. Okay. Well, thank you for coming on and hanging out with us for a little while. You know you're always welcome. Yeah, Talk to you later, uh, Jello. Take care, brother man. Be good, bro. Hey, uh, Bye, Jello. I'm, I'm, I'm. You know, I'll be done in a couple of hours. You know, it's that other thing I do. You know, but um, if you're gonna be around playing, uh, what's it called? Oh uh, well, we'll probably we'll be in my in server Discord. or caches or something like that. I was actually say we might, uh, I might stream a movie for everybody tonight if they want to do that. But we'll, um, but yeah, we'll be in. I'm sure we'll be in one of the servers definitely. All right, see y'all later. All right, be Take good, bro. Ooh, shit. All right, so let's <laughs> attempt to get through the rest of this. But we do, we have confirmed there is <laughs> oil and sauce on the bed. Yes. And a piece of garlic. I think that was a piece of garlic well, that fell off. And now look at the face. He's just like, oh, well. Oops. Oh, well. Now it's just Ooh, on the look, bed. Look, it landed in the oil. I'll dip some bread in that in a minute. Oh. Smells like chicken. That was Shanny's little taste test. What's the verdict, honey? It's almost like chicken. Like, do I've never had mussels. Do they taste like chicken in no. any way? No, hell no, they don't. Oh, there you there go. He is. Are you okay? I, I, I kind of passed out for a second, but I'm back. Oh, oh <laughs> I've been in the background. I've been watching for like 45 minutes now. Yeah. Uh, well, well, you just had, in the you background. Had, well, you had us worried, man. We thought, yeah, no. we, we, thought we broke you. Literally, no, we thought no. we short circuit. We like, did we short circuit slam? No, <laughs> I, I just been watching in a dumbfoundment and have been not able to speak for the last at least 30 minutes. Yeah. Well, we did That's break fair. Him. Yeah, that is true. Barbecue chicken almost. What the fuck? How does seafood taste like goddamn barbecue chicken? It doesn't. It's he said it's in a, a garlic wine sauce and it tastes like barbecue chicken. No, the re Shanny, fuck both of these idiots. The reason anything tastes like anything to you fucking morons because you don't brush your teeth and you smoke like fucking chimneys, you fucking and they don't it, wash their hands, lizard. so she probably Take still had barbecue chicken on her fingers. Oh, God. Yeah, probably. That's actually a really good point. She probably, like, it, picking up the hot muscle, she probably just... Hot muscle. She and probably just we... picked up... <laughs> like, it melted all of the caramelized dog shit on her hands. She's like, wow, barbecue chicken. Even though <laughs> it's more likely just fucking cordyceps. I hope. And here we see the the might the mighty shanty bear in its natural environment. See as its massive paw reaches into the trash, <laughs> the silly human left behind. Yeah. Hear the grunts of her <laughs> as she ingests her prey. Oh. Dude, is this is this is Rev the new grizzly man? Is no. he the grizzly man that survived? Because he only stayed around one bear. <laughs> Tastes like Tastes oysters. Like oysters. <laughs> Wrong. Yeah, Easy. yeah. I was oh, about to say, man. take a drink and calm down, there, bro. Can we I get a can, can, we, can we can we get a bra for lizard? Yeah, can bruh. We in the chat. Yeah, bras and chat for lizard. Hey, right, let's finish this sauce. up. I need to go get some food of my own. 
make some food. Oh, and there we go again. Yep. She saw something good. <laughs> yeah, see the fingers? Mm. Look. She still got barbecue sauce on them. That was from like six the months ago. Yeah, I was about to say, that's from that whole barbecue chicken that she ate like last week. Yeah, that uh, that blue on her fingernail is actually just icing. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> No, it's because she doesn't know how to wipe properly. Yeah, I was about to say, I thought she just had an itch. I would eat you guys. I mean, go uh, hit hit the uh, the J button real quick. Just hit the J. There you go. There, there you go. Right there. Look right at there. Her, look at her hand. It's greasy. It's greasy. Yeah. Like maybe y'all have, Jenny's y'all have hand seen... in the grease is why they decided to lower their camera quality oh i am i 100 percent guarantee you are correct on that they they lowered their camera quality because they realized how bad they look and they didn't want everybody to see the flies god ew <laughs> i want to hide <laughs> <laughs> sorry uh, i didn't mean it no no you're good that. I thought there was something Bones on my computer trail. screen I... and I realized it's just their wall. <laughs> <laughs> Please get a sponsorship, man. This you I would eat you guys every day. You're not eating <laughs> me, motherfucker. That's not how that works. You don't get sponsorships by restaurants this way, dummy. So no. uh that statement he just made, can I use that in court to get a restraining order even though I've never met him? Ladies. Tell I you. think so. Can you imagine? Can you imagine his, work? Can you, can you imagine his his breath crawling straight up you? Oh, oh God. he goes Ew. down. In, blizzard. Ew. 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 You broke man, you down broke down mango you. and you pissed Queen <laughs> off. <laughs> we got we got an echo somewhere. Fuck. <laughs> it's all good. All right. Yeah, I think it's. Was and people will buy your food. Mm. Ladies. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Sponsor me, Jason Avocados. <laughs> Go fuck my yourself, name. You're on YouTube. <laughs> Jason Avocados. Who cares? Mm-hmm. In tribute to Nikki Cato Avocado. No. And Orlin. No, it's the simple fact, and, and I've and I'll i I definitely agree because <laughs> I did hear uh I think it was it may have been Bran or Billy or Frank or all three of them say that he's incapable of coming up with his own personality. Yep. So he has to steal from everybody else. And this is clearly ripping off the, the Nick Acabado, avocado, whatever the fuck it is. Right. But dude, this is not original. You're, you're acting like you're the first one to ever like eat on fucking camera. Look, I mean, man. no, <laughs> He like it, yeah he has he has no originality and I've said before that General Zonfer is the the only original thought he's had right I think I've been corrected on that and it's like it comes from like Battlefield Earth or something like that but everything else in that book and everything else in this motherfucker's life is just taken from somewhere else now it's oh, yeah. fine to it's fine to emulate people it's fine to like take ideas. You don't want to steal jokes and you don't want to plagiarize and you don't want to be so close to somebody. It, it's it's cool to be like, inspired by somebody, but make it like make it your own. Put your own twist on it. Do something different. Don't just fucking steal from the person and just be like, yeah, I'm, this is, I've done this and da da da. Like it doesn't fucking matter. You're stealing someone else's gimmick. That's all yeah. you're fucking doing. Like, <clears throat> for instance, okay, ladies. I'm sorry. Hey, I, apolog- I wasn't going to drink today. Well, I apologize. And <laughs> I just want to say like Rev in all of his qualities is a, he's horrible all around, but at least, at least his lips aren't actually crusty. They're just ribbed for your pleasure. Oh, like, fuck, yeah. dude. <laughs> dude. <laughs> Bruh. You know, no, no, no. Hang on, hang, hang on, hang on. He's gonna go to timeout for just a minute. Let him think about what he's done. No, when you do that, he just thinks that he's hilarious, and he's gonna do it again. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna do it again. (laughs) 
Uh, hey, oh, it's okay. His teeth are too. God. I'm looking at you guys on my screen right now. <laughs> Slim's looking at me like, if I weren't so tired. You're my favorite ass. YouTuber, Nick. 100% now. Your videos make me happy. AKA. I die from alcohol poisoning, blame lizard. <laughs> you're welcome. I already you should... did. He, he says that uh, Nick Akato, Avocado's videos make him happy. Yeah, because he jerks <laughs> off to them religiously. So. This is very true. <laughs> <laughs> like, uh, Rev actually idolizes Nick Akato, Avocado. Like, in the kind of in the same way he idolizes, like, Alex Jones. And he wants to be that person. But he has no idea how what the pathway is to be that person. Where, like. For Alex Jones, you have to actually work in journalism and then be crazy and then go through the 90s and then the 2000s and be crazy and have a war happen and then also be crazy and then COVID. You can't just like <laughs> have you can't just like that shit's just not handed to you. Right. Uh, plus all of the problems that they have as well. And uh, yes, I will put my link in the chat. <laughs> I'm already getting it. It's fine. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. I always appreciate it. Mango's a peach. I'm talking to you on Mango Cameo. is a peach. I'm going to send you this video. <laughs> and he, he probably, probably is just, just like, who the fuck is this? Mm. Mm. This is their, like, corn chowder, I believe. You just said it was a dip a few minutes ago. I got an echo from I'm somewhere. supposed to be using yeah. this for the chips. This is their... It's almost like a fondue type of thing, but it's fondue not fondue, really. Um, it's a bunch of seafood in like a creamy dip. Sort of like spinach artichoke dip, but it's all seafood. Fall. It's, it's a seafood. Fall on the bed. 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 I think too. Fuck, oh, damn. fuck you, Rev. Fuck oh, you. On. <laughs> <laughs> Make me give, him, give up on my dreams. Mamma mia. What you go? Oh, thank you, Mango. I really appreciate it. Mama Mia. All the links for all of our uh, oh. friends and family around here are in the description, folks. Like the stream. Yes. He doesn't. Oh. He, he he doesn't know enough words for how to describe anything, so he just like says catchphrases. Right, yeah, kind of like G Man with the wrestling bullshit buzzwords. I'll be right back, guys. Like, uh, what's his face? Negs does the does the same thing all the fucking time. He just speaks in buzzwords and talking points, and it's just like, it, I mean that I that happens when you stream twice a day. You run out of fucking material real quick, right. and like even, I mean I I have material for months. I could sit here and you know for like a, an entire month and stream every day. Well, That's because it, I do it once a week. Well, it's just like <laughs> you know. You know well, Lizard, it's just like when you were doing media and I was working mm -hmm. in the radio business. What do you do? You sit down and you have production meetings. You Exactly. Like you plan, like when, like me work, working at a radio station, they would be like, okay, hey, you're going to go on location here this day and mm -hmm. here this day at this time and be sure to get your, you know, your breaks recorded and everything put into the system for this, right. you know, this airship. And for you, it'd be like, Hey, we need to get this done and edited and shot and all of that, you know, yeah. like we, double time. We always had a list of, we always had a list of stories that we we're going to do. And me and my, uh, a section leader, we would sit down and anytime we had like a, a little bit of a lull, we would be like, okay, we're going to take advantage of it to like regroup and like get a little bit of rest and relax. Cause we were, we went for like weeks, months, just like charging through. Right. We would sit there and be like, what are the stories that people want to see? Um, obviously explosions. Okay. Uh, tanks, guns, uh, medics, things like that. What are the things that are important that we also need to spread around? What information is important? Well, uh, medical training is really big on Camp Arif John. So let's focus on medical training. <laughs> what kind, how can we make that interesting and how can we make it boring? There, you there you go. We just have, we just got two different stories plus a, uh, plus a uh, spot right. and all within one meeting. 
Exactly. You lot realize you've spent almost an hour looking at Rev. Is this some kind of prison torture? Um, <laughs> Ask him. Yeah. He's the only one that's been there. <laughs> <Right>? <laughs> well, I don't oh, know. Next thing. Jesus, Mary and Joseph, is this enough food? <laughs> I'm. I. Slap him. <laughs> calling. What is I'm he doing? I don't know what that was. Uh, what? I'm sorry, but like Rev, there's something I've I've explained this and I've said this shit to Mango before. Anytime I'm chewing and I'm talking, I cover my mouth. And I learned that I learned that from like ladies, like and girls you when I was yeah, when I was younger. Well he's doing a mukbang. I kinda understand it, but like, dude, if you're talking, cover your mouth. Even if you're not gonna be spitting shit all over the place, it's disgusting to look at. Because your mouth is full of food. Just do this. People can still hear you. They know your mouth is full of food. You're eating. It, it's like be, when you have a little bit of your courtesy. Mouthful. Right. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Take the fedora out of your head and don't chew with your mouth full. Get your shit together, folks. <laughs> That's okay, but because it's still good. Yay. <laughs> Spaghetti. What the fuck was that? <laughs> I just want to see that little move again. Spaghettios. What did you say? Well, okay. He fucking said Spaghettios, man. Dude, I I need that clip. That's going to be a super chat. Okay. (laughs) Okay. I'll I'll, I'll get it later. I'll get it. Oh, no. I I, I have it saved in one of my lists. Perfect. And I'll I'll DM, I'll uh, send you a DM with it. Please. I was gonna say I, I just downloaded it, so. Please. Oh my god, this is gonna be fucking hilarious. Hey, spaghettios. <laughs> what the fuck? Spaghettios. Season <laughs> if, if, if you use that as a super chat, you have to let him say it both times. Uh, oh. Right. Oh, you bet your ass I'm going to. <laughs> bitch. Fire for effect. <laughs> the video's in your DMs, Lizard. Thank you, Mango. You're a peach. I'm listening up, you bet. No, Mango's a mango, not a peach. Psalm 25 went through my head. I'm walking through the shadow of the valley of death. I might pass away. What? Oh, what the fuck? <clears throat> What's in the middle of his forehead? Uh, I'm not sure. He he rubbed his head just a little while ago, and that appeared on his forehead. Oh God! He Maybe the blood he rubs bit. some makeup off of a giant. <clears throat> no, no, no he, I'm he pretty popped... sure it's oyster sauce or the muscle sauce that he just rubbed on his forehead. Probably oh, when, when he oh, when he did the spaghettios thing. Probably, but, but I think. Well, well, yeah, yeah. Well, let's 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 d- go to the instant replay. <laughs> That's a great pause right there. <laughs> All right, here we go. Yeah. Okay. Now, now wait a minute. Now there it is, right there. You see it? Yeah. So it's gotta be further back than that. If wait, do one tiny thing for me. Start at the beginning of the video, what? really fast, okay. and then we, we're at ten fifty six. Okay. Start at the beginning. Just see if it's there. Yep. Right there. Yeah, it's already oh, there. Oh, shit. Okay, okay. He's just that nasty of a bastard. Yeah. Cheese and rice. Okay. Hey! Spaghettios! <laughs> and he's shaking! Spaghettios! <laughs> He, he honestly just looked like he had some kind of religious experience. He's <laughs> like, five went through my head. I'm walking through I the think, shadow of the valley of death. I might pass away. I think oh. this is just his wet brain fucking like, it's just reacting to something. Like he has to put something out. But Yay, it, it though I walk through the valley do. of the shadow Avenue of death, I might pass away. <laughs> feeling. Sure, why not? He doesn't, he doesn't know. That's what he just <laughs> said. <laughs> but he doesn't no, the, know. Look, the, Bi- mm, the Bible can be interpreted in many Dude, ways. Dude, you have chips. Don't dig your fucking fingers mm. in it, you sick fuck. Mm. Oh, dude. Go back, go back like five seconds. Nick Gatto, will you do... 
Show, mm. look, show his hand. Look yeah. at his fingers. Let's watch. Mm. Stop. Uh, oh. oh, they're so greasy. Wait, wait till he shows his palm like feeling. this. Mm. Just all... wait. Just keep going. A little bit further. Yeah, keep going. Keep going. Keep going. After he eats it. Mm, there's another for me. Mm. There. Like, right? Fuck. You can see. It's so dirty. You can see the dirt in the fucking crevices, man. Like, oh. I have a key somewhere. I'm not going to show my key. All right, that's my house key. <laughs> Someone can copy it. Anyway, <laughs> it's got it's got dirt all up in it because it stayed in my pocket while I was at work. I use that key every single day to it should have worn off, right? Should have worn all that dirt off. No. Oh. No, it doesn't all the time, Rev. Wash your fucking hands. Get a fucking napkin. <laughs> yeah, I bet you're crying over that sandwich you're getting every day now. Yeah. Nick Gatto, will you do for me? I'm Revelation News, Nick. You know. Uh, I thought you said you guys were close friends. Cameos for my beautiful Shani, and she loves you. She loves you, Nick and Orlin. We love both of you. Look at that. Oh. Yeah. Dude. It's just uh I think you really need to do a bonefish grill. Muffman. Wait a minute. Hang on. What is on his pinky? I was you beat me to it. A bonefish <clears throat> grill. Muff. He's cut open his finger. Is that a dirty band-aid? Uh, what the fuck? Hold on. Is that a Band-Aid? Yes. Please tell me that's not a Band-Aid. It is. Dude. <sighs> Dude, I switch, you, I switch off Band-Aids after I, like, change my fucking... To me, this is what? Pen, no, it? it can't be. What is it that? Is. It's part of one of the muscles. It's... Yeah, it's got to be, it's something from the food, because it looks no, like it's, it's a Band-Aid. Oh, crap. Keep playing. Let's see. This is my favorite dish over here is the mussels. See it going around? These beautiful No, muscles, but you can see his Prince fingernail. Muscles. Yeah, you can see his what? fingernail. What the fuck is that? I think it's just, I, maybe it's like a it may be, back out now, of a muscle. <laughs> now, well, now, if it is, in fact, a Band-Aid, it may be one of, like, those really small ones that's like a dot. You know, like you'd cover up something like a paper cut or something with. I, they have see-through ones too. Yeah, yeah they have clear ones. But I don't. It, I don't know. Let's keep. Like let's if I was to going. put a bandaid on my finger right now, you could. But see I'm going for the other through. things more. Go figure. Uh, oh no, that's a circle bandaid. Ah, uh, <laughs> why? Oh, Focus on whatever the fuck it is because that. I, I zoomed in on it. It's not a band aid, but what? it's unclear what it actually is. It kind of looks like a clump of hair. It's something Ooh. like it's. I I seriously think it's like uh like the shit sack out of a mussel or a shrimp or something like that that just got in there and now it's stuck to his finger and he doesn't realize it. And if you don't understand with how fucking disgusting that is, leave my house. Has he wiped off his hands once uh, in this whole, at, at, at any point? In his mouth? No, he has times. not. Of course. And he's he's licked he... his fingers and his hands, but he has not used a napkin or a paper God towel. damn it. This is what I would do. I would just get these mussels, and then I would use like the bread for dipping in this sauce. That's all I would get. I don't even really need this stuff. Then why did you get it? I but don't. but All that's I not how you eat, you dumbass. You sauce. actually need food to survive, dummy. The extra sauce. For well, I mean, to be fair, he was living off uh, peanut butter jelly rice and baked bean pasta and mustard on Slim Jims. He was living off his precious. I know my precious Ice coffee and mustard packet. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> we don't deserve fat dogs. No, no, we don't. The bread. 
I said shit. What? What? Okay, that yeah. is just fucking creepy. Yeah, he's fucking. You're weird, Rev. I said shit. I don't even know what that word is. I it still doesn't. Yeah, I still okay, don't know what he said. So I was just looking through the video. He got it as he was dipping the bread into the sauce from the mussels. It is. Yes. It's got to be. It's some kind of. Okay. Oh, maybe it's like seaweed or seasoning meat or like dill, maybe. I don't know. It came right off the edge of the. <laughs> I got lizard, the dill right here. Like Lizard fucking, wins. <laughs> I don't know. I'm, it's gross. But but like okay let's let's just take one more moment here to just what is like, he doing what is he saying what is going on hang on I'm let me so... turn it up just a... oh. there's no closed captioning so I'm so hungry. I think I, gotta... I think he said he's gonna join I think... ISIS. Oh God! <laughs> I said shit, Ugh. and now he just stares blankly. Brain's not working. It's the lip brain. Yep. I said. Shout out to Foodie Beauty. What? And in the ever living fuck was that rev P play <laughs> that shit in its entirety what that was a fucking religious experience that he just had what is going on in your brain motherfucker are you, are you talking what? about where he was staring at people yeah okay, play the on. whole thing through okay hang on here we go <laughs> mm. i said shit He looks like Poindexter off Revenge of the Nerds. I said, hey. Shout out to Foodie Beauty and Pete. What? I'm Revelation News. The I love you. What the fuck was that? His brain just like paused and like reset or some shit. Yeah. He turned off for a minute. His, his brain got an update from Windows. <laughs> Holy shit. That was something said, else. Christ, we, love you. we love you. And um, Pete's is like a geek. Pete's is up my alley because he's a geek, you know. I want him to believe in Jesus, but he doesn't have to. It's okay. Whoa, low battery. All right. Thank God. You He doesn't have the bingo wings in this one. Did you? Oh yeah, of course Shani's like, of course I can shut it off for you immediately. She was ready to fucking go. Hell yeah. She was like, yeah, you're not, a, I love you're not you guys. screaming. Jesus Christ is oh. the way, the truth, and the life. Come to him. He loves you. I'm Gosh, Jason Avocados, man. and this is my first mukbang. Yeah. Bonefish Grill. Did you just say fuck yeah. me? <laughs> I can't. I cannot get over that shit. I cannot. That Dude. is special fucking Ed from goddamn Crank Yankers. I don't that know. was probably one of the worst things I've ever watched. I'm not gonna lie. Can you? I can't believe you had never yeah. seen it before. And once again, shout out to Burnt Toast for having for yeah, letting us Toast. use that. that thank you. Amazing. Thank you so much. Um, and it was a lot of fun to play that for Lizard for the first time. <laughs> yeah. Dude, that was something the fuck else. <laughs> um, see, now, I, see, because what I, I, I mean, I could have, if, if I had eventually, if I had found it, and, and thank you, Miss Mango, for finding it. Thank you so, so of much. You, you, you're yeah. a, you're amazing, and I'm sorry I made you mad today. So. Um, <laughs> it's fine. I have a stockpile of Grits videos to get you back. Oh, Perfect. <laughs> Uh, it's, um, 
Oh wow! Um, it was it was awesome to well <laughs> not, no it was disgusting to see this again, but the fact that that we were able to, I was about to say this is something you could show like on a like a you know later a brunch like later on after everyone's kind of forgotten about it again. <laughs> yeah, no shit, dude. I but mean, yeah, I gotta I gotta I'll, I'll pull this one up at some point because there's so much that goes on in this little ass. Oh yeah, oh yeah, and that and that spaghettios thing would make an awesome super chat. <laughs> oh, dude, I can't wait to make that a super chat. I'm gonna fucking, I'm gonna get on my ass about it. <laughs> but, well, uh, yeah, go ahead. I'm well, sorry. I know you're hungry, and um, and Slim is tired, and Cash is freezing, freezing, and. Freezing. <laughs> And I'm I'm sure Mango has some things she needs to attend to this evening as well. So we're not so instead of games this evening, folks, you got to see Rev's very first mukbang. Uh, you're welcome, or I'm sorry, depending on how you look at it. So, <laughs> um, so we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna wrap it up uh, for the evening. This has been a lot of fun, um, and uh, I do want to thank everyone for uh, for coming on. Um, I'm going to uh, I'm going to let you guys decide should should we play the 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 uh video out again like we did last week or no. Sure. But real quick. Yes, ma'am. Um we will be in my Discord or Widow's Discord tonight, one of the two. And tomorrow I would like to invite all the dads even if you have kids for that have 0 to 8 legs. I don't care. I want to invite all the dads in our group to our server for a Father's Day later on at night tomorrow. So if you have pets, you're a, a pet, a dad pet, or, or you cat, have yeah anybody cat daddy you, here, baby. Yeah, there you go. So anybody come and play with us from zero to eight legs, from a yeah. snake to freaking a tarantula. Yeah. I don't yeah. care. <laughs> the fact that I the one fact. Of those. Yeah, the fact that Lizard a has a spider in his home just scares me. Um, if I ever I come up that way walk. to visit you, I'm going to stay at a hotel. Um, <laughs> <laughs> it's not that I don't trust you, but I have a feeling that you may try may try to pull a joke on me or a prank on me with it. And uh, no offense. No, baby girl does not come out of her cage. Okay, okay out good. Of her tank. Okay, good. Uh, I mean, I'm just saying. But, I mean, he could just pick the tank up and walk it over there where I may happen to be. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, but, um, so, yes, this coming Tuesday evening, we're going to be doing our first Sanctum After Dark. It's not going to be like a regular episode, like, you know, when we number them and everything like that. This is just going to be a game stream where uh, uh, Splicer will run some games, Slim, you know, Cash, <laughs> everything like that. I'm still working on getting. Did I miss something? Nothing. Oh, did I miss something? Yeah. I, 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 okay. All right. Uh, uh, I'm, I'm slow and you know, whatever. <laughs> um, so yes, it will be this coming Tuesday, um, 7 PM central, 8 PM Eastern. So, uh, just come over here and join us. Yes. We're going to actually wait till the sun starts going down to, to start this. So, uh, well, we are going to go around the proverbial table as it were. And if you have something to, uh, to chill out and, uh, get, uh, get everyone excited for please uh let us know so uh slim uh what about you brother just the normal stuff so yeah um are you are you doing uh, a stream tuesday afternoon i think i think to uh, monday i'll probably do something and then i'll just wait until you're doing something tuesday and then maybe wednesday we'll see oh tuesday i have a show in denver Oh, yeah. okay, okay. So I forgot. Will, yeah. will Slim will not be able to join us. Sadly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I but, would uh, be... but you be you you be safe while you're traveling and uh, have a good time. Yes, Miss Mangu. What about you? <laughs> I have nothing. You're not doing a puzzle stream or anything soon. Uh, not that I know of. No. Ah, uh, actually, you know, I do have some puzzles. Uh that I never opened uh, as a kid still in my old room at my mom's house. If you would like them, I'll be glad to send them to you. 
I might be interested. It's just it's just like nature stuff, you know. So it's nothing like too wild and crazy. But I'm sure I could find something weird to send you along the along with them. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Lizard, what about you, sir? Uh, I don't have anything yet planned because I had uh pickle stream and everything, and then I was just gonna see how this went and uh, plan everything after that. Uh, yeah, for those of you that want them, uh, I'm gonna be making bo- more. I have plenty of brine, plenty of supplies, and uh, a bunch of cucumbers left over, a bunch of jars. So I'll be uh, making more of the regular ones to send out to people. Who want them and everything like that and cash is queen or dungeon queen we we do have an agreement called it um, before and so just, uh just uh be sure to um mark one of those non-spicy for for my mother because she she will she will take some of the regular deals you're making oh i absolutely will i no problem i'm gonna if it's spicy it'll have a big old s on on it somewhere <laughs> So don't worry about that. He'll just, he'll just like you know make like a fire design, like painting all over the jar. It's, just, <laughs> yeah. it's not a bad idea. But uh, extreme I'm, heat. <laughs> I'm gonna get out of here. Uh, I'm actually just gonna start cooking some food. I'm really fucking hungry. So all right, brother. Well, I will, I'll um, well, I'll be in touch with you. Um, and of course, you know you're always welcome here. Thank you so much for coming and hanging out with us. I'm I'm glad I didn't ruin food for you tonight by showing you uh, <laughs> showing you the first mukbang. Um, <laughs> yeah, but thank no, you fucking, so much. Oh, no, go yeah. ahead. I'm sorry. Oh, no, no, I was just gonna say, I really appreciate you having me, and uh, you're welcome. Uh, by any time, thanks for coming out, out to my own stream. Uh, no <laughs> problem, brother. You have a good night. Yeah, take care, brother. All uh, right, take man. care, everybody. Thank you. All right, and Miss uh, Cash, we will either be in, I guess, in your server later if we, if we want to share i've actually found a couple of movies if anyone would be interested i did find the man who would be king i did find the man who would be king and i did find uh green street hooligans so we can see what everyone wants to do but um you're you're uh uh mod so you know yeah i'm gonna well i'm also well i'm also going to uh take a little while to eat and my two cats have been like trying to get my attention for the last little while yeah, I need to get I need to get my dab dude here anyways before I friggin' pass the hell out. <laughs> right. Well, all right, everyone. We will see you Tuesday evening once again. It will be seven uh, seven p.m. Central, eight p.m. Eastern. Going to be a Sanctum After Dark game stream. We're just going to be hanging out and just uh, having fun as always. So uh, let me make sure that I have everything ready to go on my end. I should have been doing that while I was running my mouth, but oh well, things happen. <laughs> all right. So everyone, until Tuesday. Uh, Once again, 7 p.m. Central, 8 p.m. Eastern. Until then, my friends, as always, peace be with you. Bye-bye. I should answer, where do you come from? From the east, and I am hoping that you will give my message on the square for the sake of the widow's son. Well done, gentlemen. Congratulations. As chairman of the Order of Skulls and on behalf of the council, and the 322 alumni throughout the world. Gentlemen, you are welcome. Welcome.
Well, I tell you, let me give you a little inside information about God. God likes to watch. He's a prankster. Think about it. He gives man instinct. He gives you this extraordinary gift, and then what does he do? I swear, for his own amusement, his own private cosmic gag reel, he sets the rules in opposition. It's the goof of all time. I think church is, has very little to do with spirituality. I think... Uh, it's something you have to find in yourself.